anything unless he's muted. Hello, Twitch. Welcome yeah, to the for talking before the session. I like the music. Ooh. Reminds me of singing in uh, in the choir in the uh, at the temple back in the days. That's exactly what it is. Wait, are we doing a background <laughs> mission today? No. Oh, okay. I don't know. I'm just saying. <laughs> Imagine the plot was suddenly, uh, like, coming back to each other's backgrounds for a moment. But it turns out to be a nightmare or orchestrated by Strat. Because I, I don't know, we all managed to fail <laughs> an offline <laughs> constitution saving throw and we all fell asleep. And now we are in a nightmare world or something. Imagine the plot twist. We actually never entered. We fell asleep in Neverwinter. Plot twist. Oh. We are being affected by a mind eater. <laughs> or something like that. I don't know. No. No. By the way, uh, Colin will not be attending today. Oh, yeah, we, yeah. He needs to get... Hopefully things go well with him. I like the music. What is this called? Tabletopadio.com. People check it yeah. out. Okay. So everything else is more or less ready. I went to the toilet. My bladder is ready to go. I Wait, recommend nah, nah. you all do the Wait, same. Nah, nah. Oh my god, last session was just a Amazing. Okay, Paris booping stream elements, okay. <laughs> Why? What happened? Uh, I, uh, I booped him. As I always do. Huh. Just waiting for Sarah to come in. And there's the verb. Yay! <laughs> okay, let's tune in to Parokin's stream and see what he's up to. Or maybe... Wait, is, is the game already shown? Yes, the map's up. Ah, uh, then maybe not. To prevent any spoilers. Thankfully for my phone, I can just turn ch just to chat so I don't have to see anything else. Oh, okay. So, I have a few new uh, sounds ready. <laughs> Who knows, maybe they will come in handy sooner or later. We shall see. We're waiting for Santa to return with a mixed drink. Uh -huh. Uh, the Brick Baker. So, I wonder if our nickname's going to actually change because I'm not my fake actor. Good question. I'm also not a necromancer in training at all. Yes, you are. You still are a necromancer in training. I did yes. nothing yes. necromancer like at all. I mean, raising yes. Colin was different. I gave him a good baby. No, I, I think we, because Why do you want me to be the necromancer? What do you have planned no, no, for no, your no. own? This this was because This was because the way you acted in my last campaign. <laughs> I was just sharing controversial knowledge and deeper insights. Uh, the way, no, no, the way you were interested in all that stuff, <laughs> even though you had Greg. <laughs> I'm sorry, I like to read and 
know stuff. Why do you think I have slightly over average intelligence? It's not from going to school, well, temple. No, it's <laughs> from reading instead of learning. Why do you think I learned so much? I know so much about nature and medicine. It's because of the local gardener druids, whose name I actually don't yeah. know. We all called him just Master Druid. He was nice. Well, he is nice. But you also told Camera me to go back to class. Intelligence is good. There was a wisdom tree. Is, wisdom for you is the best, though, because all your spells are based in wisdom. Yes, uh, I did uh, actually know that, and uh, yeah, I. That's why I uh, took two levels in uh, wisdom yeah. for my feet. I thought yeah, about maybe uh, eventually switching it out after all, in case I get like items that gives me two wisdom in the future or something i don't know the, the only thing that i would i am a bit concerned but i think you can work around it is your low con uh, is your constitution i have 10. yeah it's it's normally you want to have a decent constitution but you got high ac so you you should be fine for the most part, as long as you stay back. Okay. I mean, I kind of need to do second front line. But you will see why. <laughs> you be careful with that second front line, because your, your HP is... I know, why am I so squishy? Come on. I'm a cleric, I'm a warrior of a god. <laughs> Why yeah, do I have only 30 squee? Hello? Yeah, you don't get that much HP. That's bullshit. Well, oh, wait, I'm one, your constitution is 10, so you don't get any points in from that. Oh, wait, you do? Constitution gives you HP, helps you with the HP. Oh. With each, uh, like, Which 12, has 14, and 16 would have been, oh. like, one point extra, two points extra. Oops, for ah, I rolled it. Points. Oh, I got the 19 accidentally. Oops. Yeah. Like, <laughs> Oops. But that's, that's fine. You built, this was your first character and I can understand. So you built it. Uh -huh. God damn it. Okay, I need to Help. And maybe level next constitution build See, well. You can do it however you want. I just saying if you want if you want to uh, survive ability, you won't have constitution. If I have or, uh, seventeen, what will happen? Either high dexterity or uh, oh, high, that's uh, quite a difference. Yeah. Ah. <laughs> I yeah. I see. I almost went with the lowest uh, health possible. <laughs> oh. Okay. I see. Yeah, but hey, here's the thing, you do have a decent AC though. I know, I did that on purpose. So, that is a good thing. I know. You know, if the funny thing is, somehow, f from the logic of it, uh, I don't know, maybe the fighter can, but uh, you have a shield, but you can't actively, like, prevent attacks towards yourself. It only counts as an additional AC. I mean, okay, it makes sense, but mm -hmm. it's because just it, a decorational could... item this way. Yes. Why? Why can't yeah, I have yeah, an ability to like roll for a block or or parry or repost like yeah, a Dark Souls, for example? That you can get, there are certain feats that you can get to help with that. Yes. Uh, but also, the another thing is, oh I have a God, feat. A shield expert. There's actually a feat called, I believe, shield expert that helps with that. Uh, I think shield expert only helps uh, for dexterity saving throws. Take no damage at but, all. Yeah, for some things, yeah. Yeah, like, but how many attacks do have dexterity saving throws? Like, if I get uh, a 
<laughs> I know, Fireball, for I example. I tell you that right now. <laughs> Fireball, yes, but there are multiple <laughs> other, like, You're meanings to... You're being surprised too. what has dexterity saving throws. Yep. What I... or, or just in general. Hello, or if, like, if... Baker. Hi. Uh, but by the way, though, like, your shield, too, like, straight up, it's kind of tough, like, with Claire, because they may not have a lot of... Uh, dexterity things they can do with it but there are some classes where it's like if you have a shield and you do this this happens or there are like feats and stuff um and also too when you talk about ac uh right. it's kind of like simulated that you know you're not just dodging attacks you could be just like glancing blows yeah, and like, stuff yeah, like I that know, I like know. when you rate you could raise your shield that's still part of your ac and it blocks you with it blocks with the shield yeah it, yeah this is this what I... It's not just passive. It, it's not just passive capabilities. It's everything that you're doing. I know. Uh, but what I'm on about is... Uh, like... I don't roll to... Block a blade. It, it's just there. I it's, mean, it's just... It if you had the shield expert, you would have a an, an advantage against my hellish rebuke because it's a deck save. <laughs> so, yeah. Uh, okay. Um, why why are you telling me this like that? Why would I if have you to need to me, have? You might find out. <laughs> or like I have a monk ability where the the I'm other person notes. does make a deck save. So yeah, there, there's also a tax that you have to deal that mm -hmm. require deck saves. Well, okay. Uh, the thing is, I have a feat which I don't know if I will have the chance to show today, which I learned in the downtime uh, that makes the shield well feel and work quite like a shield but for others only and for some reason this feed the same doesn't exist but for me personally Interesting. I have which to seems like a missed opportunity as a feed B. I think Actually, I'm gonna have to which doesn't make one. sense I mean yeah. I, I can use it on others but I cannot use it oh. on myself Huh? I would say this though, for if you really are like into into uh, shields, I would potentially look at the fighter class because they do have a fighting style that's oh, they call protection, and essentially like you could just like if you're holding a shield, you can like absorb not absorb like you can, like deflect damage if somebody else is getting attacked. Wait, so well, is it are you saying protection while wielding a shield a and a creature you can see attacks a target other than you within five feet? You can use your reaction to impose disadvantage on the yep. attack roll. And that's huge, actually. It's actually like really good. Guess what? Guess who has that feet? Has that? I Do you have it? it nice. So I can I can cause them to make another uh, make a disadvantage. I am uh, that's, uh, that's thinking. Big. Uh, cool. I was thinking about. Uh, I lost a thought. Wait. Hey, uh, Perro. Ah yes, I'm I'm aiming to become a 100% level 100 cleric if I can, and uh, edge out uh, my other smooth out. I think it's rather uh, called uh, and smooth out uh, my other capabilities outside of magic, like melee combat, for example. Yeah. Well, most importantly, melee combat, because uh, sure, I can support the others and myself, I guess, kinda, with magic, but what if I can't cast it suddenly, or if I have to fight uh, face to face, you know? Well, I, I technically have a support item that helps me and everyone else. But having Basically, higher no constitution you, would be very nice. I could cancel a crit. If it's within thirty feet of me, which has been done already, you it helped out uh, Ballas. One on me and one on uh, freaking Ballas, yeah. Yeah, because like, I remember last session. Yeah, I'm like, oh wait, is he good? Yep. No crit for you. <laughs> which again which is, is going to be useful. Mm -hmm. Which is again, it's huge. Like, it may not like the one thing I've actually like 
what I picked up from D and D. A lot of times, I'm like, wow, that doesn't sound like it's that good, but it really actually is. Like one turn could really determine, or like one person's action could seriously determine what's happening next. Yeah. So canceling uh, crits is good, or throwing people at disadvantage. There we go. Yeah. All right, Para. Hello, purple kid. Uh, since my ability, uh, trance ability, allows me to switch out a uh, tool proficiency, may I do so? You may. Okay, thank you. Parroquet, is there a way to raise a stat like constitution, for example? Through rigorous training, it would be a lot harsher than just training for a feat. Uh, that is too time consuming, I think. You also could, at level 8, we get another choice of feat or ability score. You could put two, but again, that's I know. I that's kind of how I do it. I would rather uh, use the feats for abilities. Well, feats for feats, I cannot learn. Oh, it's up to you. Logically. Like, for mm -hmm. example, feats like being lucky. How can, how do you teach yourself being lucky is a thing of outside of your power, you know? Something like keep that, for example. And stuff like go go cars. <laughs> keep, keep killing rabbits and getting their feet. That's how you do it. Ha 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 for performance. <laughs> uh, I'm, I'm reading it up. Derek? From Zeus, I should say. I can get him really quick. Uh, yeah. Yes. I'm ready. Colin won't be here today. Nope. And he haven't hasn't they told me any busy. comments he would like to give for today <laughs> about <laughs> Kai. Oh, I think I know what he'll give. <laughs> Fireball. I, mean, uh, I yeah. have uh, three new spells thanks to that uh, sneezing thing. <laughs> the unsneezable sneeze, the unreachable itch, and that whole send you to the stars thing if you actually make me angry. Are you <laughs> actually? Yes. Like, running the really campaign nice. offline. Really, Let me put it really this way. I am keeping track of your guys' sanity, and that will definitely impact it. I not <laughs> yeah, about the sanity. I am not happy with you, Rivali. Do not give the DM ideals. Hey, don't worry. <laughs> I, I have no like idea it. how to counter that, but RP. for that, we should all be together again and pray. Why do you think we four are praying in the church right now? To steady our iron to, and iron our will and uh, uh, go on faithfully and strong. Hmm. For now. Hey, come on, I'm trying my best. I have the info. I must <laughs> do something about it. But yeah, I'm not safe. going crazy. I will not. This is a test of my... Uh, a trial of my face and strong will. <laughs> and to see how good you can control the masses with your fate. Now's with a good time. You think the fairies? <laughs> Why are all of our pupils dilated every time we eat a good berry? What's oh, that no. about? Oh no! Special urge to dance with you and praise your god. <laughs> oh no! Dead children! I think I'm going insane. Do not worry, for your will <laughs> shall not falter <laughs> as you do everything in goodwill, and stuff is turning for the better. You shall encounter more, but never f uh, lose hope. Something like that. Hey, come on. Uh, excuse me, Mr. Priest. What if I don't believe in your god and I believe in another god? All you hear is smite. <laughs> <laughs> oh, you're part paladin too. Got it. I have <laughs> it. <laughs> Not even that. It's just die. All right. You took 90, 999 uh, radiant damage out of nowhere. You've chosen death. Die. So you <laughs> have chosen death. Power word kill. Let's see. <laughs> Let's see. One, um, is it, two, is it, is it? Three. Three smite spells. <laughs> Not to mention my divine <laughs> smite. <laughs> I smite thee. <laughs> I think I am mentally the healthiest right now. <laughs> yeah. 
<laughs> I mean, come on, I'm acting like that. I mean, okay, sure, last time was dangerous, <laughs> but I kept my cool. For now. Yes, and I shall continue to do so. Now we are praying to calm down and steady our will and mind and fortify Roaming it. Roaming religion. Uh, <laughs> I can also technically pray now because I'm also a paladin. <laughs> <laughs> I have also found religion. Yay! Yay! Although I don't have any, you know, pluses in religion. Wait, 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 I, have, I have so many but... buttons here. <laughs> ah, there it is. I can also do that, but... So you have chosen death. <laughs> I am prepared. Oops, <laughs> button. I am prepared. I have the memes on demand. <laughs> Oh god, all the updates to the fucking handbooks. Yeah. They're all they're coming out with more too. I saw that. Also, and it's not only D D that's doing it, a lot of other tabletops just figured twenty twenty four was the time to do it. It may as well. Yeah, it's like a whole yes, uh, freaking what is it? Uh, Find the patch day. Oh, I don't know about patch. I have no idea, to be honest. I didn't look at that, but a lot of the skirmish things I follow, a lot of like old school guys, even like they're updating their rules. So I don't know. It's like they just got together. Uh, I'm like, hey, let's make money. <laughs> I guess if we're waiting for Zeus, can I buy stuff from the store? You may. All right. I gonna, sure. I was going to have go was, go on the shopping spree while I'm still worried about you. And I don't know, beginning to start up moving to the next town because I don't know you are apparently dead Aww. by now you haven't you, returned you, for oh, hours here's the thing, here's the thing. Oh. My what is character, it you'd like to buy uh do they does he have any kits like tools let tools me see kits. here hmm. yeah, she's gonna try to buy as much as she can <laughs> he, has, a he has a climber's kit a healer's kit and I'm going down the list here because he's got a money limit for what he does sell and he's also overcharging like a prick <laughs> it's not like I can find a freaking that's about it uh, yeah okay. so he doesn't have a cooking oh. kit yep he doesn't have a, does he have a chef's kit no okay well done Hey, if, it's okay if you blow money on it, because I'm, uh, Kiki's about to have a conversation with Darren about uh, this guy. But he doesn't have any kids that she... Oh, no, 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 I'm just saying, I'm just saying you might get a five-finger, uh, discount. Or a refund. <laughs> no cooking kit, so she can't go, so... so. <laughs> I mean, that's also the issue with acquiring women across the street, you know? Yeah, I feel like that's <laughs> actually where we're, My that's where we're gonna be going next. Yeah, she's still sobbing, by the way. <laughs> exactly. You've done nothing to help her. Yet. Well, I mean, there was two kids watering the street needing help. My priorities kicked in. I'm like, look, she's older. She has mental, you know, things in place to help her deal. Have Those kids who are, who are dead, by the way. Have you uh, read <laughs> no horror <laughs> books in your youth or something? Like... Who goes in a ghost town to follow suspicious children? My Hello? I hope children that are in trouble. What's wrong with you? Yeah, yeah. what's wrong with you, man? I thought you were a cleric. Is that your necromancer side talking? Is that what we're seeing? <laughs> what does the necromancer yeah, side have to do raise, with it? Wait, you should, you should love this. You should be like, I could raise these kids from the dead. <laughs> he's not He's not species, sexist or anything. He's just against the living. <laughs> <laughs> You're alive. I have an issue with that. Go away. <laughs> Screw you. I'm changing my spell list. <laughs> what do you do? Add more necrotic damage to, damage to it? Go ahead. We still have the no, I'm going to make my own friends. People that are actually logical in this situation. I, I am logical. He is. That's yeah. the sad part. Kiki can Kiki and Santa Eel can get actually Eel can actually have a not actual discussion with Santa Fia now since Who is Xanafia even? 
Oh my She's god. She's the most suspicious in this group. <laughs> I know. Well, you're still in praying, so you got. You're done praying. Uh huh. We are undoing the that? horrors we have encountered. In form of yeah. being scared or something. Man. I'll do the same with you. If you come back alive. If not, I'm sorry, I gotta reload my Lightbringer then. Chick chick. Oh, wait a second, I'm prepared. You mean the one that uh, doesn't work as, like it's supposed to? But it works! <laughs> it's not as full, at its full strength. <laughs> but it works! And it's heavier! <laughs> you fool! My mace still does the same amount of damage! <laughs> you really want to cast this? I do have a holy Avenger sword. My character hasn't noticed it yet. We know. Yet. <laughs> we know. Yet. What what time? A legendary sword just like that. Oh, by the way, I got a legendary sword. You what, mate? How? Who are you? With a very high roll. Yeah, very high roll. That was the only really good high well, besides last session's high roll. Uh, I mean, they got a billowing cloak. That should tell you enough. Which is yeah, like the one fattest of my loot ever. Is a billowing cloak. That, oh, you know, I mean, Ying and I do. Yang. I am going to talk to you, Paro, about fusing the billow cloak with my ring, by the way, because with the new. I'm going with 2024, Monk. Uh, right. The ring is great, but I don't have to uh, worry too much about it. With oh, movement, right. so uh, I just want the cloak to billow even more, essentially. <laughs> <laughs> well, be able Who are you trying to billow? seduce? The yeah. fans. What she's, fans? An, she's a pro wrestler. So ah, we have to well, together your ring and your cloak. Yeah, I think they're, it's the ring that's given me the uh, unrestrained movement because I'm gonna definitely do with. The 2024, which that solves the issue. And the uh, I'm going to keep going with Speedy, by the way, as well as my feet okay. that I'm training. So that's just, at some point it's going to be kind of like, eh. So, yeah, I definitely will fuse that ring um, with the billow. I might wait till I get another item I need to attune before I do it. But that's just my plan right now is yeah. pick the ring, and <laughs> billow it, go with the billow and just make the billow cape even flashier right now. Right now, as we're talking, since there's nothing else, Xana's gonna just crack open the book. A book. Yep. Yep. And read. Yeah, that's that. The funny thing is, that's what I got for the last thing. Yep, I saw. You saw. You saw my book. Yeah. Oh, I, I snoop on you guys. Don't worry. <laughs> I do too. I do too. Sometimes so I don't. Do, 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 do. No, I, I got do not. I read. <laughs> She's gonna crack open a book and read it. So I'm guessing after I read all 48 hours worth of it, I can actually activate it. Yeah. Da, 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 da. Give me one second here. I'm looking for the synthesis that I had put together for your cloak and ring. Yeah, buddy. You actually got it ahead of time? <laughs> nice. I do, but I'm changing some details because I, I made this when I was very tired. But it's still here. <laughs> By the way, Kiki. What's up? Do you have a monk temple somewhere? A what? A monk temple. Like Shaolin temple? A monk temple. temple? Yes. Uh, not really, no. She's not a monk in the sense of traditional monk. Oh. It's more or less the fighting style she took up. She's she's actually more of a gladiator than a uh, monk. I, I, I thought you Tra were she, a monk. She, her, her, ma her master might know, but her master is not here right now. He's back oh. in Neverwinter. I was going to take she vacation and uh, train my constitution. <laughs> <laughs> what, you're just going to leave the fog? <laughs> no, your constitution? Uh, afterwards is a downtime or something. <laughs> right. While learning well, a new feats that. or something, That's I just, don't know. Actually, do you know what you should look at? Uh, literally, if you're looking for more hit points, uh, look at the tough feet. It just adds hit points. Yeah, it basically. Can I learn the tough feats? Yeah. 
Technically, I should be, be able to. I, I think it'd be trainable. Yeah. Is, that what... is actually pretty good to, if you don't have that in Constitution. Yeah. Mm -hmm. it, it's a... just to cover you a, a small, a small little mistake. <laughs> but that's all right. We all make mistakes with our characters. Trust me. I mean, I wouldn't call it a mistake. I, I thought intent is very good to have. I didn't really like realize it. I mean, I did it, do something okay, with Ravon. my charisma for, for reasons. But yeah, okay. I'm not perfect. That is why I'm not Ooh. yet the uh, I. Ultimate hey, Eternal gonna... Champion of Sylvanus, yet. Well, I'll, I'll, I'll tell you this much. I did watch a campaign that did have a cleric in it who had it negative in their constitution. They had a, a an A constitution, and they still did pretty well. Like I said, it's they, they didn't get in the fray as much, but again, they did pretty all right. They healed, and they were a storm cleric, so they healed and damaged, essentially. Yeah. So again, having low con doesn't mean you fucked up. I know, but no, if it's one versus it's one, I have. Good constitutions always. Okay. Good. If it's one versus it, one, I have. if you're gonna be frontline then. Yeah, but if it's one versus one, uh, and I'm fighting against a spellcaster, uh, my AC might not always help at all. And mm -hmm. one so... hit may almost kill me. <laughs> but I'm so, working yeah, towards you it. Do do that uh, synthesis now. Uh, I'm going to say probably once we get something else that needs to be attuned. I mean, it really isn't unless unless if I transform it now and it has to be attuned to me, the new it, item, uh, the new item has to be attuned to you. All right. Yeah, fuck it. Let's do it. <laughs> All right. I will more remove your ring. Remove oh, I got to see this cloak. I'm excited. Hold on. And by the way, has everyone gotten his new items? I got a book. Yep. Oh. And it has been added to your equipment. Oh boy, oh boy, oh boy. <laughs> I, I actually have to see this one. <laughs> Even more pillow. Uh, is it Traveler's Cloak? Nope. It'll be sitting in your equipment right now. Oh, Cloak of Freedom. Yeah, brother. Well, Read it out loud for everybody. <laughs> While you are wearing, okay, so this is the freedom cloak. While wearing this cloak, you have advantage, yes, on performance checks. You may also use this cloak to inspire others, enable them to ignore 10 feet of diff, yes, 10 feet of difficult terrain and free them from restraining conditions, paral paralyze or restrain. This feature will apply to allies, not to yourself. I love that. <laughs> You can free others, however, there is not a limit to charges. For the sheer nice. fact that having it paralyzed or restrained is a very rare thing to happen, considering there is already a check. And mm -hmm. it is a very basic thing, but this is partly what synthesis will do for your items. Ah, huh. nice. I yeah, love it. Have some. Since you know, you gave me a book, there's no need for me to synthesize anything right now. <laughs> <laughs> no, but uh, yes. While looking at the cloak of billowing and your ring, I was sat there and going, both of them have essentially a movement aspect to them. Let's just uh, expand on that. I heard Katie. Dude. Oh, you already yeah. opened the map. I didn't bruh. notice. You, bro, you just could have stopped that advantage on performance, and I'd have been like all over it. But yeah, that's a, the uh, just the fact that I can help other people move. That's pretty good. Because yeah. I'm kind of addicted to the uh, movement speed this character and why I'm going for speedy just the additional 10 on top of the like movement speed I get from monk is beautiful yep but yeah I'm going to keep some effects of both items but they are more than likely either going to be lesser or they're going to be shifted nice that nice. is something to look forward to if any of you want to do synthesis if any of you yeah. want to do that now right let me now know. I have items that are pretty good useful Maybe the next thing I might uh, do is that uh, my uh, guardian sigil with something, but... I am afraid to ask to what happens if I combine my new item with my healing stick. Would you like to find out? No. no I, I'm dude. just curious how it will look like. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, you know What's what I have. Happen? I mean, okay, it's more this like is... a name pun, but okay. I have to see, what is it, your 
new item has? How many? Oh, okay, it has those six. Okay. Hi, kitty. Are you gonna keep fighting? That's my foot you're fighting on. No. So you think we'd be passed out? He might be, because he's away too. Yeah. I mean, we don't know. He's always invisible. No, no. <laughs> he might be. He might be here. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, he he was up late with me talking though. He he kept like we were up to like five my well we're the same time zone so he's up, we were up to like five in the morning talking last night. He might uh, be out. probably. Well, he, no, he was online about a couple hours, a few hours ago. Yeah, well that's his sleep schedule though. He gets up at like like late like really or early in the morning or like super late and then like goes until the afternoon or evening. Yeah. Let me see here. Your freaking thing, if you wanted to combine those two, was wonky because it has multiple things to attach to it. Oh god, that would be chaos. Give me one second here because I got to. I got a rainbow. One of these things stuff. I made when I was tired. To be honest. <laughs> Ach, don't worry about it. No one is complaining yet. You know what? I'll yeah, play just for the sake of, of it. <laughs> already ahead of time to see what if we decided to synthesize. Kiki, please you. do not annoy the god. I you cannot balance out everything you people cause. Kiki looks up at the sky and flips at the double birds. <laughs> well, good thing we are the clouds in just form into double birds themselves. <laughs> <laughs> okay. F you. Yes. Did you actually go through all of our stuff and see what each of our stuff would have been like? Not everything. Like I said, I did a lot of this when I was tired and I was just sitting there going, wonder what this would do. And So you I already did something with my guardian emblem and my cloak, didn't you? Yes, but since you gave away the cloak, I scrapped it. No, not my... No, I had the guardian cloak. Oh, yeah. I will admit I put together your guardian emblem and the billowing cloak that you handed off. Not the actual guardian cloak you have. Yeah, oh, that's sweet. I, I have the cloak of protection and guardian emblem. <laughs> Dude, d just just a just an AC increasing cloak that gives you perform advantage on a performance. I'm not gonna lie, that'd be awesome, man. That'd be pretty I mean, cool. I already get like plus four into my performance anyway, so. Dude, yeah. Just make an advantage now. <laughs> Let's make it better. Why not? I was say, if you guys want to talk about where you can go from here, go right ahead. While I fix my multiple spelling errors that I made while making your shit half. <laughs> yeah, I did find one in mine, but I'm, it's okay. It's only for my eyes. I don't need it fixed. Uh, yeah. 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 Zen is just still reading a book at this point. I haven't even uh, started learning my wood carving tools yet. Now's a good time. After session. Well, I mean, now currently, right now, is also not a good moment to logically <laughs> learn them. <laughs> we are not safe enough, you know. We have to keep watch. <laughs> it's not like you're traumatized by what happened earlier. I'm not, no, I mean, uh, the only role I could have done logically would have been the very first one where we uh, stayed here for the night. Which I forgot we're, about. <laughs> we're, we're, we're taking a, I mean, not this session, but at some point we're taking a carriage trip over to another town. That might and be some good time to time for her to, to make it to read the two. <laughs> yeah, that's what I'm saying. There, yeah, like I said, there's going to be a trip going over at some point. So that'd be a, or like, uh, even like, what was it, six hours if you're not elven, you essentially need, or if you don't have feats to be fully yeah, rested. I, mean, I could, I just need four hours of sleep because I'm an elvish. Okay, so, so yeah. Like, yeah, so you can like do, you can do your four and then your other two or I don't know how long, if it's six, I you need, can do your I other two. I need four hours of trance and then four hours of just, I can do I have to drive and yeah. keep out for our surroundings. I have to keep Wait, my eyes peeled. I could hold on. Let me see. Do I have? No, that was Domino. Shit. I was gonna say if I have proficiency in land vehicles, I'd be like, just let me drive <laughs> and you can do it. <laughs> that was for some reason he just he knew how to 
drive a carriage. I don't I don't get it. You shocked the fuck out of me with that one. And you made him. <laughs> yeah, I know. And I'm like, oh, yeah, I, I can do land vehicles. <laughs> when did you learn this? Hmm, who played you while I was gone? Wait, Someone I played my character. Want, I am curious, actually. <laughs> I am curious. I'm, I'm going to check something real quick. How much constitution did uh, Domino Chakras have? Uh, let me go check. He had, I, he, it was pretty up there because the Barbarians, they actually get AC based off their constitution. Ah. So it was a stat I was into. Let me double check it. He was at just, oh, he was at 16 constitution. Oh, wow. But keep, you know what had, the funny thing is? <laughs> <laughs> Xana can actually, if I would have long rested, uh, do another long rest, Xana could actually do vehicles. Land vehicles. <laughs> there you go, right? Just random ass people just know how to drive cars. <laughs> what well, is the thing? Up. How? My character, because I could do trance, she can, uh, change. Oh, switch your tools. Change. Yeah. I yeah. can switch to, uh, whatever proficiency of, like, something like that's cool, actually. Actually, let me read that. Well, at least I can sing in a choir and play the organ. Where? When nice. you finish this trance, you get two proficiencies, each one a weapon or tool of your choosing from the player's handbook. This lasts until you finish your next long rest. Nice. Uh, just to finish my thought, though, uh, Rivali. Yes. Um, even with constitution, with high constitution, like some classes really some classes excel more in health than others like barbarians they get more hit points on average than unless you're rolling but if you're just doing by average which we're doing like a barbarian will just have higher health essentially so there are classes that do get more hit points classes, just for being a class races, some species, yeah like like there's the what was it the gold dwarf yeah oh they're tanky gold yeah. dwarf yeah mm -hmm. well, okay it's called a gold dwarf they get x they get they get one point more uh, HP per level up. Mm hmm. Okay. They get one extra HP per level up. I mean, you mix that with like tough and having a decent con, it's pretty good. Or a good class. Like if he's a barbarian, shit. Heck, even my uh, created race, uh, the Kitsavari, the bear, the bear class, the bear one actually does the same thing. Mm hmm. And if you combine that with, uh, what was it, Dra uh, Draconic Bloodline, which also gave, grants you another HP, Sorceress could be, a, you get a Gold Dwarf Sorcerer, and jeez, that Sorcerer's gonna be HP tanky. Mm -hmm. But that is ultimate uh, with Max, I, I would like to stay cleric. <laughs> Yeah. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Well, I'm just saying, like, if you like, for if you're making any future characters and you're like, I really want like a high HP guy, you know, it's just something to consider. You know, yeah. like, hey, your class does make a difference. Maybe I'll make a race. cheesy character class in the future. Race. If I wanna overdo it, maybe. But I this so. trout, I just wanna be normal. <laughs> Why? <Wow. laughs> normal. I Cleric only. Normal. <laughs> yes, you normal. You're saying the dragonborns aren't normal? normal. <laughs> <laughs> What's let, that let, me tell you, let me tell you something. <laughs> let me tell you something. What's normal for a spider is chaos for the fly. Ruvale. Yes? Would you like to see the item that I had in mind for your staff and prayer beads that you have? Sure. While we are waiting, sure, why not? Kill my All curiosity. Right. No, I will remove your prayer beads and staff of healing then. But, but temporary. Well, I'll just show you the item here. And where was it? There it is. By the way, yeah, apropos staff, I, I still have the wooden spear part without heads you never actually got the rest of it I looked everywhere did you One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty, twenty-one, twenty-two, twenty-three, twenty-four
four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Yeah, that didn't change. But it's sitting in there now. I have to make one change because I didn't change a freaking condition. David, I have to have return to find Delva. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> the what? Hmm? I'm looking at his inventory. I'm waiting for this to come up. <laughs> I'm suspecting it lies somewhere around in uh, in the in the in the uh, magic smith magic workshop. Um. Uh, yeah, that yeah, that triggers me. I completed the game ninety nine percent. Unacceptable. <laughs> <laughs> Let me leave Bovaria really quickly. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just gonna pop into the other room real quick. Don't mind me. Plane shift, ploop. Later, Gator. <laughs> uh, didn't you say some shit happens though if we try that? Essentially, the plane shift. It doesn't work. Yeah, it doesn't work. Nope, it does not. <laughs> so much for sneaking out of here. Uh, okay, where exactly can I read it? right by your Staff of Healing. Staff of Mercy? Is that it? Oh, yep. what is it? Why does that have one charge? Oh, yeah, that's why. What? No, just fixing some things, because like I said, half asleep when I made this shit. Only you can use the action to expand one of its charges to pass. Oh one wow! One charge. Interesting. Oh, okay, that's up your alley, dude. That's actually pretty good for you. Staff regains. Okay. Plus four expended charges daily. Okay. What's the plus four based off of? Is it just the staff? The. Say what part is that? Uh... Is it his wisdom? Because he has a plus four in it. Yes. Okay. Well, the plus four is base for the staff itself. Gotcha. Okay. I had to double check what you were talking there. Yeah, it's just the one d eight healing plus four. That's not bad though, man. Because you're you're like uh, again, I'm not bitching about uh -huh. this at all. But uh, yeah, you're you're like you're on the uh, the healing board, and I'm like, hey, <laughs> I'm okay with this. Yep. Yeah. Double Although healing. I can. Hmm. A wave Which, of healing energy washes. Not as much. I'm not. I'm not the healer, so I'm not. Shit. <laughs> I'm assuming dude. that you uh, looked at the rest of it. <laughs> yeah, I'm taking. I'm dude. I'm peeping the uh, mask here wounds. Nice. Plus your spell casting ability modifier. God damn. <laughs> Right, I, I feel safe. Uh, Three it's, like, <laughs> it's like the staff of feeding, but two extra charges. Yep. Yep. And the actual charges on most of the spells did drop because you essentially combined two similar items. Ah. Okay. Right. There. I should have fixed it now if you want to refresh it because they're fucking. I should not make homebrew crap when I'm tired. Yeah, that's where you get some of your really good ideas. Yeah. <laughs> your whole brewing yeah. mind's busted. <laughs> so the full description. This staff has 12 charges. While holding it, you can use an action to expend one or more of its charges, cast one of the following spells from it using your spell save DC and spell casting ability modifier. With you, this would also include your bonus healing from your life cleric domain. You can cast Cure Wounds, and you can charge it up to fourth level. Lesser Restoration, which will cost you a charge. Mass Cure Wound costs 3, Bless costs 2, and Greater Restoration costs 4. All spells cast through this medium now have an area of effect of 10 feet. Oof. You are unable to use a shield while wielding this, and it regains 1d8 plus 4 expended charges daily at dawn. So oh, okay, so the charge is... Okay, the charge is slow on it. So, yep. wait, does it mean that... Uh, wait, yes, I... Uh, that I can cure wounds people in a 10 feet radius? Yes. 
starting from the point of impact. Wow. It goes five feet one side, five feet the other. Oh, Think wow. Of it, it's well, yeah, so, kind of kind of 15 feet. It's a little wonky with it being 10 feet. Well, yeah, it's like if me and Zana were close together and you cast Cure Wounds, it hits both of us. Yep. I should yeah. probably change that to 15 feet because 10 feet is going to be fucking weird. <laughs> yeah. I'm actually not curious what happens if my cloak got an emblem. <laughs> I will actually have to take a look at your emblem and cloak because, like I said, I planned it for the other one. Sorry. Yeah, you, have, <laughs> you thought I had the other cloak, but... I, I took your useless ass cloak and turned it into my own thing. Yeah, you. Hey, <laughs> I love it. Hey, it was okay. better for you than what for me. <laughs> no, it, it was. Like, I'm not going to lie, man. I was like eyeballing your cloak, and I'm like, man, I would have so much fun with this thing if I had I mean, it. Here's the I thing. Santa doesn't really need a cloak of, cloak of billing. She Nobody. Just think of it getting away. Yeah, it, it's just swag, man. That's all it is. <laughs> She actually has a cloak that's quite useful. Yeah, okay. no, no, your, 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 current cloak, your, your, your current cloak is pretty good. But like, yeah, your billowing cloak, though, it's like, yeah, yeah. nobody really needs that. <laughs> I love useless items, though. You could take a bonus action to do that. Yeah, um, I'm getting one AC and saving throws to this cloak while wearing it. Okay. Yeah, like, that's pretty good. Okay, the stance okay. is actually awesome. I mean, okay, I probably will not use Greater Restoration at all. Huh. Mm -hmm. Oh, I guess I got all my charges back because we have what does had that restoration long rest. Again? Yep, you Did all got a long rest. rest. Mm -hmm. Yep. So all my charges for my emblem are back. <laughs> Just in time. I because <laughs> thank God, you know, more shit's around the corner. <laughs> so I got, I guess my uh, my question oh, my about my cloak is, would anything me uh, me helping somebody move the ten feet of difficult terrain, or freeing them from the paralysis or restrain, would that be an actual action or would it be like a bonus action? That would be a bonus. Cool. Okay. So you're you're essentially using a bonus action to inspire somebody. Hello, and what? that right. effect on them will last until the start of your next turn. Gotcha. Okay. So them being freed of paralysis and restrained, they'll get freed of it once, and the 10 feet, if that runs out, they'll start going normally. Right. Yeah, that makes sense. I just wanted to make sure um, I'm spending the right resource on it if we need to go that route. No, I like it. I, I, I don't know why, but like, dude, the cloak of freedom that's like right up my alley because <laughs> i love freedom <laughs> the man of the, uh, there's some someone just popped in don't know who it is Sorry. speaking of freedom <laughs> who popped in i don't see, I see what are you talking about nothing here but us chickens i had something i had a boop that's it i heard nothing <laughs> must have been the right. bits well you are Oh god, I don't want to think of that song. What? Has anyone seen the Chalk Eaters song, Must Have Been the Wind? Oh god. You've seen it, Pero? <laughs> yes. Yes, I have. <laughs> That's what I think every time he, freaking someone says, Must Have Been the Wind. It's like, oh god, not that song. <laughs> not this shit again. <laughs> All right. Uh... Hey, Z, Whenever I hear the wind, I just think of dust in the wind. Dust. I just think of breaking wind. <laughs> I've heard that song too. <laughs> <laughs> I play it every day in the morning. <laughs> it's usually, uh, it's usually started by a can of beans. <laughs> <laughs> That's where all the inspiration comes from. By the way, motherfucker, my perception roll beat your spell check. <laughs> There's a reason I have poison damage. You're about to find out. <laughs> Silent but deadly, literally. <laughs> the original SBD. Oh, God. I, mean, I see. You want me to roll again for uh, uh, stealth? I see the oh, no, no, I, I, don't, I, don't, I don't pronounce <laughs> this out loud. I know, I'm just like, she takes, I was like, okay, I know where Darren is. <laughs> she doesn't say it out loud. I know where this is going. <laughs> my current item heals uh, cure wounds 
better, but the stuff of mercy uh, does an area effect. Yep. Your stat, your staff of mercy is very good. Is what it is. I um, am. I am seeing and free and free spell slots essentially. Yeah. He is like I got even more healing capabilities now. Wow. Mm hmm. Uh, that's what. That's what you're good at, man. You know yeah, how to heal. Know. You're good at it. Let let the pally tank. Oh no! I almost died anyway, so I started healing. <laughs> <laughs> Jokes on you, you wasted an action on me. <laughs> okay, <laughs> sorry. I think well, for well. now I would uh, keep with, with what I have and uh, take the stuff of mercy maybe one day in the future. I just mm -hmm. want to try out the new items for now. Yeah, dude, that's that's how you play D&D, &D, man. You get weird with it. You just fucking try new shit. Yeah. Go out of your comfort zone. So, staff yeah. of mercy, not now, Parroquet. But interesting choice, actually. Well balanced, oh, I would say. I mean, greater restoration, the effects it does, I can do with other before, spells too. Which I will start, have. I'm gonna, yes. I'm gonna just make myself a quick screwdriver, so I'll be right back. Alright. Yeah. Uh, which I will have uh, spell slots now left for. Hopefully. Hopefully. Hello, Zeus. Yes. How are you doing? <laughs> How was your week? Uh, yeah, I was playing board game with uh, board game with the family, so that's why I was a little late. Yeah, you're good. Very. Good. Uh, Mina was doing a shopping tour. Mina. Mina. Seafina. Uh, <laughs> Seanya. <laughs> Zana. Zanafia. Zanafia. Yes. Yeah, there was nothing. There's literally nothing that she could buy. That like, reminds me. I would like to buy garlic. Cooking. As much as I can. After we begin. I mean, I am ready. Just saying. Uh, very fun conversation. How do you create custom items? It would be in the homebrew section. Oh, okay. Like, is there something like an actual editor? Yep. Oh, Wait. that's cool. Where did I get these cook? What? I have Smith tools and cooking you cook. Oh, that's. In the controls, never mind. Sorry. <laughs> God, got a little confused there for a second. <laughs> no, she just needs uh, certain, certain, certain tools that this dude doesn't have. There we go. And I believe this makes for a good idea on what it is you have. There we go. That the applicable and I will pop it onto your screen here into your equipment. Hey, I'm in? back. Hello. I'm back. Thank you. And equipment. I'm say, do you want to do the synthesis for volley? No, not now. Okay. For now, I would like to try out my new items. Normally. All right. We'll but interesting that. choice. Your uh, new item will be sitting in your equipment underneath your guardian emblem. Let me. See. You do You're lose some in. things, but. Oh, I almost forgot. I actually forgot part of the description. 
I feel like I'm going to be kitted out with only healing yes. items. Healing boots, <laughs> healing pants, <laughs> healing ring, healing napkin. <laughs> it stops me. You, you are the most liked party member of the group. <laughs> Everybody <laughs> does not want to piss you that, off. That is actually interesting. Although I do lose the able to be stopping someone else being critted. However, once always I, being I, immune to crits. Say, what is your? Yo, a question about the new D and D rulebook. What is the highest AC someone can have now? That depends on a whole slew of things. Yeah, uh, they they changed a lot in it from just what I noticed. They they're taking powers away from the feats and giving them to the actual classes after just skimming it. Yep. But there's some there are some really awesome changes, though. Like, I actually would love to play a 2024 fighter, to be honest, like just being a champion. Go ahead and refresh your character page. I should have updated the description because I forgot to put in the rest. Uh, OK. <laughs> There you are. If it does load, I might have to delete it and re-add it. Can and I reach an AC of uh, 52? Just tells me I to have bonus to AC, saving throws, and immunity to crits while with his cloak. And I can cast a sudden build power before charges. That's it. Oh, try it now. Go ahead and uh, refresh. My first bud. <laughs> Hi. I play D and D. What about you? <laughs> <coughs> He's squeaking. No. Oh. There you go. Oh, There's there. the rest of the description. <laughs> there you go. She wants. She wants held. Mm. My kitty <laughs> wants always <laughs> freedom. Mm. Yeah. <laughs> If you don't realize this by now, I'm very fond of area of effects. Yeah. <laughs> that is a very useful. Would you like to read it aloud for the rest of the party? Fireball. Okay. Fireball. Gain, uh, this is Guardian's show. You gain plus, bon uh, plus one bonus to AC, saving thirst, and immunity to crits while you wear this cloak. You may cast Compelled Duel for charges. This spell has a 20 foot radius and may affect a number of enemies up to your proficiency modifier. So as of right now, what does it do? Xanathia can compel three enemies to focus on her, much like a tank doing a taunt. Huh. Nice. Reminds me of old school. Wow. You have a, what is it? One of the shouts. Couldn't, yep. couldn't you have just said nice fish you or something oh, oh fish I mean, you all you mother yes. lover technically uh, yes but with this is an actual spell and they have to make a save otherwise it would be her role of intimidation against their role which is good it, it's just like an old school tank essentially why don't you have a taunt effect would you like to go ahead with this synthesis I don't if know, man. It's pretty pops sweet. Up in your <laughs> face. Thing, yes, I no. lose the ability to stop someone from getting critted, though. Well, I'll, I'll means... say this. Oh, sorry. I'm going. I'm going. Go, you go ahead. No, I was going to say, actually, you know, because I like I think a beautiful com combination for that would be you do your step, get resistance, and then you use that and just draw everybody to you and you're taking half damage. If you know they what? Hit you. Yeah. What the hell? <laughs> Let's. Let's but go I mean, with it. you you don't. I mean, like I said, that that's. I think it's good. Like you don't have to take it if you have another idea. But I'm just saying, like no, that's just. No, what... I, I like actually what you just thought of because yeah. <laughs> I okay. have my. All right, there goes close yeah. protection and cloak of God and Guardian. Right. Oh, Guardian. That's where my head went instantly. Back to like World of Warcraft days. I was just like, yeah, man, you you could you essentially take all your you, you half your damage no, and you have everyone hit you. Inventory. There you go. I've fixed your inventory there. Now that Zeeth is here, is there anything you'd like to synthesize in your inventory? Uh, let's see. Not really, because everything kind of works out right now. Because the item I got last time, that didn't that doesn't require attunement, which is strange. 
And that was, what was it? Gloves, Gloves of Bravery. bravery. Yeah, yeah, they don't require attunement. Nope. You may, however, if you'd like, I will admit I did not get to you. If you'd like, I can whip up something depending on whatever two items you want combined. Mm. Just to give you sort of an idea. Zeth, I'm in a tournament in Mountain Blade. It's okay if you do it on my books. <laughs> <laughs> I need time to fight. <laughs> That's fair enough. Now I am now. not immune to crits. No one can crit me. <laughs> Which is huge. That's Which very huge. I, I would have to say that is actually... You don't think about it. I mean, it's it's only if they land on a 20 side or if, unless they're champion or something. But like, I mean, not taking double damage, essentially normally bending a roll like that. man, It's not bad, man. It's pretty good. And then I could also say, fight me. Exactly. Yep. With the good resistance that you have. So I say, hey, lean into it. Yeah. yeah. Jump into Frey using my free feet, gaining my free ability. My because I'm going to be honest, my brain's looking at it like this, that Xanathia is the solid tank, Tiki would be the dodge tank. Yep. What am I? I movement high C. You are the healer. healer. <laughs> You're the healer. Okay. <laughs> yeah, that's, yeah. that's what you focus on. I was going to say, if there's any two items that you want to see a possible synthesis for, Zeth, just let me know. Hmm. One day I will be stronger. You are Hopefully. strong. You, it, it's not. It's not all about damage, dude. I mean, no, healing it's is not sexy. About damage. It's not being <laughs> but I have room to grow. Up damage. Yes. yes. Oh yeah. Do. Absolutely. There's always uh... need for room for a heal. See, I'm a paladin. Yeah, I can heal a little bit. But she's more for smacky. I'm more of a divine smite. <laughs> or you know, saying smite or wrathful oh. smite or smite. or elder blast. <laughs> oh, yeah. Blast. yeah. Eldritch Smite. Yeah. There we go. Huh? Eldritch Smite. <laughs> oh, I would love that is an that be a move. That'd be such a fun home. That'd be such a uh, fun thing. If I remember correctly, Eldritch Smite, I believe, is a invocation warlocks can take. Fuck. Yep. 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 Mm -hmm. So it is an option once you can get the invocate when you if you decide to swap out invocation. Yeah, I could do that with uh, every see. level of Warlock, but I'm thinking getting my uh, Paladin up to level 4 before I go back to Warlock, because I want another... I want to get a feat as soon as possible. The level uh, 4 feet. Honestly, right now, I don't think I have anything that really would benefit from combining. Fair enough. Imagine David becoming so invisible and stealthy that any touch of him just tears reality apart. Well, the only real thing that gives him any bonus to stealth is his cloak. Yeah, that's that right I mean, there is my biggest item has been that cloak. I yep. swear, if he flies as a bat through the door, I'm gonna. F uh, uh, you've, bolt already, him. you've already seen me do a bat thing. Mm hmm. Why? <laughs> yeah, Did I? you yeah. have. Uh, it's a trick fight. During Why don't the, you do it? During the fight with a bunch of the, the, that bunch of ghouls that he wasn't the there. Ch yeah, yeah, but uh, the zombies in the oh, hallway. Yeah. But he, your character wasn't there though, El. No, yeah, El wasn't there. No. Everybody else saw it. Yeah. And we went. Oh, it's just that's just what Derek does. It's just Derek things. Huh. Yes. Okay. <laughs> Stuck it, Romans. Are you watching football? <laughs> no, no. I am a uh, the TLDR is I am a Viking in Mountain Blade. I am going over to Roman territory and committing crimes to weaken their faction. I am and playing I'm just a going around... game. <laughs> yeah, dude. I was just, dude. That's what I do when I'm waiting. I play games. Uh, so. <laughs> I am talking to you all instead while waiting. Yeah, I, I can do both. <laughs> I'm good at doing both. I came up with a tactic for Kitty <laughs> while doing it. And I'm in the pretty tat. Yeah. I'm here, though. I won my tournament, so I'm ready whenever. Mm -hmm. da, da, da. I'm just weakening the Roman Empire. <laughs> 
Uh. <laughs> Santa's still reading the book. Relaxing. How long has <laughs> Question, how long has it been? <laughs> Pops off the book? <laughs> About an hour and a half. So, uh, she, that's... She's now down to 30... 38 and a half hours. Roughly. It doesn't matter no. which key you no. try and press, it's not going to do anything. 42 and a half. 42 and a half hours. No, it don't. Nope. See? You can't hmm. even chat to anybody on this. Because now would be thirty would be forty three then half of that half an hour would be forty two and a half. Are we good to go or is there something else yep. to do first? Waiting on someone. Oh no, we're good. I mean I'm good. Ooh, I, I'm I just saying it first. So I'm just gonna say like Kiki walks in and uh she pats EL on the shoulder. No one is walking in pop just pop like that. Excuse me. <laughs> I'd like to roll. I would love to roll a strength check against the door. If this the far. door is locked. We are I want to roll an attack roll against most it. Most likely. <laughs> Go ahead and roll. Roll an attack roll. Does a dirty 20 hit the door? That hits. Damage comes out to... 14. Are you kidding me? And uh, this is going to break again. I'm just looking over that. Xana's just looking over that. What are you doing? Well, Man, I mean... Like that, I've already lost track of Derrett on the fucking map. There you go. <laughs> 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 hey, I said go south. <laughs> I'm, Fight I'm looking it. across the map going... Wait, I'm supposed I'm missing Valus, but I got rid of his character since he's not here. Who the fuck where's the goddamn lizard? There That's a good stealth roll. That <laughs> is my <Right>. door. <laughs> that is enough for you to essentially shake the door enough to ra rattle dust off from the entire church. Jesus I just look God. at I look well, at Zana and I go, Hey, you don't know what's on the other side. It could be them. I mean maybe they got raided. We see if are I can get alarmed in. now. Two people are hiding uh Inside the room, Donovich and me are preparing to fight, I guess. I don't know. Donovich, uh, what are his thoughts? I am prepared to strike. We don't have shit in the lock. Technically, how would we have long rested? The door should have been already unlocked. They are back. <laughs> As far as you know, they found out you liked. It, but uh, if you want to sit there, <laughs> hey, I'm gonna say I meditated yeah, outside. I was, I was outside. <laughs> I mean, I came outside and reading the book, so so technically, door was not locked because I came outside. Keep, I think he's just gonna roll eyes. Right? It was like you, the door. Uh, hey, you bunch uh, of. You, you it, it's us. You just open the door, right? It's not locked. It's it's locked. <laughs> I try. I open the door. Okay, can, can I try opening the door? No. It opens fine. <laughs> oh shit! Are you kidding me? I close the door. Oh, the, okay, you, close, you... <laughs> you close the door, but you did not bar the door. Oh, that's embarrassing. Well, I'm sorry for my English. <laughs> <laughs> I barricaded it. Door. In this day and age, you need to bar the door. Lock I barricaded it. No, you with, a, with what? All the pews were destroyed. Remember? I closed it as much <laughs> as I can. I'm, I'm gonna say this, just, just from speaking from like a medieval guy, a lot of doors have bars on them in medieval times. Yep. Bar the doors. <laughs> if you want to lock them. Always bar the doors. Especially when there's vampires. Apropos vampires, they returned on the witch. What do we do? I just you kick in the door. <laughs> He's kicking it. I'm like, hey, we're back. Ah. Wait for the GM. You're the one that's at the door. I'm waiting yeah. for your reaction, not the Dodger. I mean, what does Don Donovich say about this? I am prepared Donovich to fight. Not over here. He's actually getting some sleep, considering he stayed up all night. Shh. Okay. 
You were the one standing guard by the door. You went to get some fucking Jedi. <laughs> okay, okay, okay. So set this as a current situation. Uh, I would think you're already all the way in, Kiki. Nah, I just kicked in the door. I was kicked in the door. I was like, "Volt we're back. Earth, and I barricade the door. The, nope. the door is already open. <laughs> Orvale, I want you to give me a strength check, considering you're on the opposite side of doors that open in on you. <laughs> oh, God. Uh, I want to see if you can stop yourself from being fucking pancaked. <laughs> yeah, she, she, remember, she's a wrestler. All right, not bad. You managed to stop the door from squishing you. You do not take any damage. Okay. I yell for alarm, set, because we are apparently de most definitely under attack now. Uh, <laughs> Santa puts the book away and what walks in way? past Kiki. Uh, I would like to cast <laughs> spiritual weapon as uh, a support unit. I... She she grabs him. Santa grabs you. Calm down. Mm -mm. Ah! I would like to use my reaction. Like a fucking war victim, considering he just faced down a fucking horde of vampires. I would like to use my reaction and swing after the head that is grabbing me. Roll to hit. Also, Zeeth, I just sent you sort of a demo version of what I would synthesize. I just picked your dagger and your luck stone. Okay. And I would like to yell alarm. On the character sheet. Did you try it? Was that a hit on me? Because uh, that just glanced off. Yep. That is not up to your AC. Oh, that's not? No. Oh. But yeah, it would be under the cloak of bat in your equipment, Zeus. Yeah. Don't know why it says one charge, though. What the fuck? I'm having a Somebody time today. wants to. <laughs> they are back! <laughs> no, it's the MG! Monks are like onions! They got layers! Flesh bang out! This is gonna turn into a, such a weird kerfuffle because if Kiki just sees something attacking Zana out of nowhere, she's not gonna react well either. <laughs> Say, Zeus, did you see what I added? Yep, I would lose the plus one to saves and skills. However, with each use of this, that three next to the exhaustion is three yep. charges. So one charge is disadvantage on all ability checks, two is speed halved, and three is disadvantage on attack rolls and saving throws. Technically, if you hit them twice, they are dead. Yep. Nice. Essentially, like, wear them down, essentially. Well, take a look at their inventory sheet and what their dagger is going to That's what I was it. getting ready to do. I'm like, wait, <laughs> I've got to see this. It's also why it's an odd number. It can only be used three times. Dagger yeah. Misforge. Is it the Misfortune Dagger? Yeah. Yes. Basically, I'll replace my luck stone and my dagger of venom. Yep. Okay. See. This is just sort of proof of concept kind of thing. I'll admit, yeah. I did that, a whole lot I, of It's interesting. You could wear out the, the enemy, but though, he does lose the luck stones. Well, it's yeah. just a plus one. I mean, the 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 the, the actual the creme de la creme is on top of your sneak damage, is the two d ten as well. Oh, yeah. That's yeah, burst that's damage. The that's the uh, that's what the dagger of venom normally does. That's pretty that's good. Put the dagger of venom in my mind. I was going okay. So I got a luck stone and a dagger of like venom. The venom would probably corrupt the luck stone. Luck stone would probably become the pommel of that. You have something that instead of adding luck or plus one to your stuff, instead causes exhaustion. Mm. And the fact that it's already a very potent poison, a 
It's a double dice. There's two plus the one for the luck stone. There's three charges of exhaustion. Uh-huh. Which wow. is an awful. I mean, if you do land, what was it? Two hits, essentially, they're dead. I mean, that's up yeah. to you. I mean, that's not that's awful. Exhaustion but six, I believe, is death. Yep. If it's and any boss characters, like named characters, that effect will be lessened. I will admit that. Just so you don't like one shot a boss. And yeah. Just yeah. One turn. Yeah. But it is per hit, not per attack. Well, and that has to be crippling. Crippling a boss, even to some of those effects, is pretty good. I mean, it's up to you. I'm never going to tell someone how to play, but it's not bad. I mean, you're pretty good at hitting. Just hit the boss six will, times. It will most likely be changed, but that is just proof of concept of what I'm looking at for your stuff now. Because, like I said, I didn't look through your stuff beforehand. That's something yeah. that should do. I probably would go for that. Yeah. Just for the debuff. It's so good. Yeah, because... Yeah, giving your sneakiest person the ability to essentially hamstring anybody that is going to be a very big problem even if it's just by a little bit, is always helpful. Well, yep. com- what, well, here's the thing. Combining my ability to challenge foes to get them focused on me and his ability, that could really set up certain... Tactics. You can definitely combo off of each other, yes. <laughs> it is entirely up to you guys, though. If you want something that I synthesize to have a different method... All I'd need is a basic explanation of your thinking on how this would work, and I can easily do that. Because like I said, considering this is your guys' campaign and it's going to play how you want, I love essentially tailoring stuff to your characters and how you want to play. This is, yeah. for lack of a better term, this is your story. I'm mm-hmm. here to narrate it. I'm here to tell you what happens, what you get, what you do. I'm just here to record it and narrate not pretty good man i uh i like that it's a good beer and pretzels game (laughs) cool i am here to record your epic saga of badassery (laughs) well well uh i'm not a badass i'm recording our perspective (laughs) yes uh by the way parket are you unmuted on stream if i'm not it would not surprise me nope i am unmuted (laughs) i can hear good an hour and a half later, you haven't unmuted your mic. Fuck. <laughs> <laughs> May I, I say to my own? Yeah. Uh, well, yeah. I mean, uh, one of the times I streamed, I was on my just starting screen for an hour into it. Yep. I will go ahead and take that dagger out. And I'll, essentially, if you want anything on that dagger removed or chained or whatever you'd like it, just let me know. So like I said, that was proof of concept. I'd have to do a little more digging just so it's not so bad. As well as making sure to mark, in case it's against the boss monster, how much less you do. Yeah. Uh, I guess my... my be useful. Mm-hmm. It would be. Uh, my last question is to, can you synthesize an item that's already been synthesized? Can, can you yes. just keep that going? Okay, awesome. Yes, you may. Wow. Like I said, it will get a little weird, and like you saw with Rivale's staff and prayer beads, he had two items that essentially by themselves were healing items, and as such, they combined together successfully, and in some cases, he got more charges, and the spells costed less to cast. If you mm. synthesize together different items, like, say, the Dagger of Venom and the Lux Stone, you'll probably get an extra effect, oh. but like you saw, it didn't increase the Venom damage. So it is entirely Mm -hmm. up to you if, however, you have a specific, let's say, blueprint in mind that you want for this synthesis. You let me know what it is you want out of all the items you want synthesized together, and I will fit them together like a puzzle piece. Did it actually have this charge? You did pretty well with my my guardian emblem and my cloak of protection, so... (laughs) Yep. I am... Yeah, I can't. I didn't notice a Staff of Mercy having uh, less charge costs. Some of the costs were reduced, yes. Oh, I didn't notice it. Well, that's cool. Nice. The biggest one that costs a lot is Greater Restoration. For the sheer fact, if I bring up the spell description here. You can essentially 
remove any harmful effects, including attunement to cursed magic items, any reduction to their ability scores, anything affecting their target hit point maximum. In a place like this, there are curses aplenty afflicting people. Greater restoration will be very helpful, but if you might just need a lesser restoration. You might need a greater or something different. Yes. While it is technically your healing stick, it is also a way to help those around you within the villages that are being stricken by Strahd's terror sprees. I got good berries. <laughs> good berries don't help that much. No, you sit there going, Would you like I'm to try? To, uh, I'm going to draw them away from Strahd's influence by bringing them into mine with these <laughs> good berries. Just, just have a I bite. I have a EL just becomes the new Strahd. Oh, no, no. He just takes over. All I'm I, imagining is just Cult of the Lamb with fucking Revale running around giving people berries. I am you wearing know. a red cape, a stick, and I'm, I'm casting Bololo. <laughs> Essentially. <laughs> I have all a right. church. Bololo. My, my last comment on it all is I think Revale, at some point, you just need an item that enhances your good berries when you synthesize shit. That's all. Um, oh, yeah. Wait, a good so berry. Ravala takes a hit at my uh, arm. Yes. Ah, a head of the undead. Alarm, alarm. They have returned. Alarm. <laughs> they broke through the door. Alarm. So wait, I I'm hearing just screaming and seeing somebody throw a punch. I'm coming in and I'm gonna like leave Hurricane, the person going after Zana. Where you can. Sure, you get ya. Stop poker or whatever. Or what, what, what's the kick? He screams weird shit. Yeah, yeah. Toast kick. Like spin kick. Should I either roll an attack roll? Or should that be something else? If you want to do an attack roll, go ahead. Fuck it, I'm scared. <laughs> There's a hand, fuck it. <laughs> Not literally, but fuck it up. <laughs> That's going to be a miss, though, on uh, Ravali coming in and charging him. Uh, give me give me a damage roll anyway. 1d4, okay. please. <laughs> uh, this is a 1d8 plus 6, considering it's my martial arts die. Going to be 12. <laughs> Ravali, I want you to oh, make sense. me... A wisdom check not to shit your pants as this fist comes flying past your face, misses you, and craters the wall next to your head. I could spider that? <laughs> okay, Literally, the fist is buried up to the wrist. Wisdom. <laughs> oh, That's your adventure! Let's go! Five! Why no? What the hell? Why? Why, not, the, why not last time? As you see this fist bury itself into the wall, you go, Wait a minute. I recognize that fist. And you see Kiki peek their head around the door at you. Hello. <laughs> Konichi, what's up? <laughs> huh? What? Seriously? What's the actual damning fish <laughs> are you guys what? doing? Come what in, are come you in, doing? Come in. Come into the church right now! Come in! Be quiet! Come in! Where's <laughs> Valos? Where's Aye, that? Okay, that was okay. Back he's... With the carriage. <laughs> okay, he's sleeping again. God damn it, I need to chain him finally. So. Close the door. Lock it. As good as I can. Bar it. Actually, Xana grabs the bar, bars the door. There you there. go. That should do that. So, I will remind you, as of right now, Donovich, the priest, has recommended that you take Irina away from Castle Ravenloft. Yes. The two places he told you to take her would either be the Abbey of St. Markovia in Kresk, that's sitting atop a mountainous region, or the fortified town of Valaki. Yes. What the fish fire do? 
doing? Where have you been? You were gone for hours. You have no idea what kind of shit show happened here while you were gone. Oh, you had a shit show sit in the church and relax it, huh? What are relaxing? Of course, oh, in Bavaria is everyone relaxing as we have noticed by now. Sure. <laughs> what did you do? Why you I just took care of a house. Where have you been so long? Okay, let's get slightly away from the door because conversation. We had to help some children. Ah, ah, it's you. <laughs> Oh, oh, wow! Oh, wow! Oh, you did! You, you finally think you mentioned this. Do you know what happened while you were gone? Do you know what could have potentially happened if I was gone too? I, I guess it has something to do with Strat being in Bavaria and something about Arena being wanted. Well, so you wait, guessed correct. We didn't just get got visited by one vampire spawn. No, not the vampire. By, by, uh, not the vampire okay. spawn with a few minions of undead. No, it was six on, on them behind every window. And not just that. No, the leading figure of this party was eventually even more more of such an undead army was not just a super like uh, a vampire spot no it was as it turned out the right fishing hand man in person of strat well literally knocking on the door asking for Irina and then mentioning something about us good thing you weren't here, I guess, but good thing. Oh my god, people, I tell you, oh, you will not believe it, but there was so much that could have went for, and I'm surprised that we actually made it out alive. Successfully, I noticed. Very lucky, because I kid you not, but everything could have went down south so quickly if I only imagine if I only would have stepped into the bright lighted room behind us or if the I don't know um if Don which was able not able to convince uh, Radagan or whatever his name was uh, to convince that there was literally no one here we have been here he doesn't know where we went and uh that oh my god <sighs> Breathe. Would you like a glass of water? We literally almost died. We could have died. I, I kid you not. I was standing behind the door with weapons raised, Breathe. standing, not moving, behind the door while Donovich was talking to Ra Rahadan and, and convincing him that uh, we are not here. At this here. point, Kiki just grab, grabs you by the shoulders and slaps you across the face. Just, hey. All for damage. <laughs> you're, you're alive. <laughs> Yep, roll for damage. <laughs> 24. <laughs> I'm spiking. I'm <laughs> Nine damage. No, 1d4. <laughs> Wait, let me roll. They're using their hands. They're a monk. You're taking unarmed damage. You got a scratch. Okay. So what you're saying, she's holding your shoulders, like spins you around to her. The, the short version is Important guy showed up with an Very entourage important. of vampire spawns. Very you powerful. Fended him off. Gotcha. You fended him off with words with the father. Yes, I did not. All I could do was give him mental support. And I think I barely succeeded because he was very mentally tired from this, I think. Okay, so one good job. She pats you on the head. Yes. Now imagine what would have <laughs> happened if I wasn't even here. Yes, we, we would be we'd be coming back to an empty church, maybe, probably. Yes. Second, she pulls a health poultice out. Thank you for making these. She puts it back on her belt. She lets you go. Wait. And she goes back into the church. <laughs> Why are you mentioning them right now? I mean, you're welcome, Just but saying. why? They helped. Zanuck turns ill to her, her 
You would be surprised. Who are you? The name's Zana. I know you didn't get much of an introduction to me, but I am here with you. For now. I am a Shadar Kai. And I am a paladin. I am a Hexblade paladin. Aha. Uh -huh. Okay. Why are you here? That I am still trying to figure out. I was walking one day and then poof. I'm here. So, uh huh. Can I roll an inside check? Ne is, and she, is, she's heard that he's called Nancromancer in training. So, really. You look like a heavily armored necromancer. I'm not a necromancer. I'm a life cleric. Oh, yeah. Even the uh, brand new paladin looks at you and goes, that's a necromancer. A <laughs> I've been taught this in school. <laughs> You're a necromancer. <laughs> a life cleric. <laughs> Do I believe... Then what? So you say you just suddenly went into the fog walking around Bovaria. They are telling the absolute truth. Okay, I guess it sounds plausible. <laughs> the voice in the sky says, shut up, believe it. <laughs> oh god, <laughs> is it you? If you don't believe it after this one, no. it's a nat 20. <laughs> no. Yep, you believe it. <laughs> I the double guess... middle fingers pop up in the sky and go, quit asking. <laughs> <laughs> so, I, I give it the salute back. I like <laughs> Um, Could have fooled everyone around here because um, you definitely do not look like a life cook. Are you being classist? <laughs> Excuse me, <laughs> what? How dare you assume my class? It's it's seven hundred twenty-four. I mean, let's be honest. If we we're gonna be classist, we all would have said that fucking Valis is a goddamn rogue. Who cast yeah, yeah, magic yeah, yeah. on me? <laughs> She's just doing it because she's her. Valus, she's her is it you? Necromancer in training. That's, that's all she. The reason why she said that. Did it, 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 I'm sorry, yeah, he, he just looks completely evil, so it's like, yeah, it's okay if you're concerned. I'm sorry, the armor turned out like that after adding the spikes. <laughs> they messed up my order with the other necromancer at the at the blacksmith. <laughs> well, what? I'll just keep my eye on you for now. I'll keep my eye on you for now. I and think later. they like each other, Merit. What? They're friends now. <laughs> <laughs> they are... I think they really like each other, Darren. Like, more than friends. But oh, hi, David! <laughs> you can call me Xanathia, or Xana for short. Okay. Uh, oh, I, I am ill, by the way, the life cleric. I'm squinting my eyes. So the helmet. Is that your own class, or...? Hmm? What you squinting your eyes about? <laughs> I'm looking at Sanafia. Suspiciously. <laughs> ha! Okay. Fair enough. Uh, damn Anyways. it! You seem to be. Well, kinda. How do you say? Competent is not the right word. Uh. <laughs> No, that, that is the right word. Yeah, competent? Actually, actually is. <laughs> competent, yes. Uh, Same competent. Is very very competent. Uh, <laughs> What happened? And are, are those bones? Wait, yo, what the- wait. Yo, damn it, what is that? You cannot have the bones, Necromancer. <laughs> <laughs> they are the children we helped. What? <laughs> what? <laughs> yeah, you, you, you thought you had a day, a field day in here? Yeah, we had a pretty big field what day too. What the did he, did he firebomb the children? Balus isn't there, he's by the carriage. I know, did, did he firebomb the children? Oh my, what the fish? No, no, no. Oh, they no. starved to death in the attic of their house. On their parents. <laughs> How their long have, where are you gone? What time is it? <laughs> what the fish? 
You do realize we're in an area where things like this is probably going to be common. It's an area of misery. Why is, we... why is, why is the lizard talking wisdom <laughs> with a cleric? <laughs> I'm looking Wrong confused. I, I feel like Eric, I lost the uh, fear <laughs> of time. <laughs> you, you want to handle it? Yeah. You want to, ta you yeah. want to handle it, Derek? I can slap him. Again. Explain. <laughs> Now, Kiki, I'll ask yeah. for help. We help. Yeah. And now we have come to see if their bodies can be buried. Oh, yeah, no, they're, we're, we're, what? Where they, the no, no, we're, we're burying them. The house where they were is a cursed place because the their parents and the people they were associated with did not draw the ire of the, uh, of, um, Broad. At least that's what I've gotten from the notes we found. The the, the house. What? Yeah. Oh. The, the the house the house fell apart when we didn't when we killed a giant beast in the in the cellar. So it wasn't a good idea to bury the kids on site. We're burying them at the church or somewhere better. Some they they deserve better than being buried there. So I don't care what the father says. We are giving these kids a proper send off. Yes, I do agree. So we need to talk to the father. So, wait, let me get this straight. Just be thinking you want to the baby. What? What? What baby? Wait. Oof. <laughs> Kids said. Yeah. yeah, that was fucked up. <laughs> Kids said, died. Came to you for help. You went to help to a cursed house with parents doing something with Strahd, you killed the beast in the basement and the house fell apart? She grabs your shoulders again, turns you to her. The short version oh, hi. is yes. Hi. The short version is yes. The house was evil. The parents were doing bogus rituals and apparently trying to get a cult together. The they we got to the basement. Shadow figure started chanting, one must die. We left the altar. Big freakish plant thing came out of this rubble. We killed it. House got mad, fell apart. We took the children's remains, brought them here for proper burial. We what are about not the parents? Uh, didn't find their bones. Uh, I don't think so, at least. Or we found the one. Na we found a set of bones somewhere in the attic, I think. I believe that was the, the uh, children. Nanny. We found the children's bones in the attic. The parents are dead. Okay. The wasn't there were ghouls in the basement? Yeah. Ghouls? Was, wasn't there a set of bones, though, in the one yeah, box? Yeah, there was, that, a, was the a, a corpse. Chest. A corpse yeah. of the nanny. But yeah. Yeah. I wasn't going to try and go through all of what we were going through to try and get that body. The children were more oh. important. Oh, no, no, no. I, I, I agree with you. I agree with you, Derek. The parents sound like they were like not good people. Good uh, call. We should. We're not bringing yeah? them out. <laughs> we we are bringing the kids. They deserve better. Well, that sounds yes. that very confusing. But I okay. Yeah. Anyway, uh, everything went almost very south while you were gone. Hmm. Well, apparently, it didn't because you seem to have handled it quite well. Our little light bright. <laughs> Pat your head again. <laughs> Better go light, right? Yeah, yeah, I'll take it. You know what? I think we should give him that new name, <laughs> <laughs> Light, right? <laughs> I'm already in the Discord. <laughs> <laughs> what? <laughs> <laughs> you don't want to be a necromancer in training anymore, so there you go. <laughs> Yay! Well, of everybody in the party, you're the only one that has to be lit up. Da, 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 yeah. da, 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 Everyone da, else da, has basically uh, dark vision, or you know, a great way to see in the dark. dark vision. Uh huh. Well, yeah, okay. We uh oh, I got some news to tell you. Uh, first of all, they know we are here, but they don't know where we are or what we are doing. And apparently, we are well, Strat's newest game. Uh, for what exactly, I don't know yet. I couldn't hear that much through the door. Um, about his son in the basement, 
By the way, is the sun doing any sounds right now? You could hear faint sobbing. <laughs> this one. Uh, he is dead, and he is an, an reanimated, most likely undead, most likely, likely a vampire, spawn-ish. So yeah, we can either keep him locked and kill Strat and see what happens. Or we relieve him of his suffering now. But this is something I would maybe like to talk over with Donovich present. I will agree with that. Yeah, I don't see any other way to help in any way. For all I know, the son is lost. But I don't know what happens if Strat dies. Yeah, there's a lot of good things. What time is Actually, it currently? A lot, a lot of good things. It would be... Considering you started all this morning, it would be around noon. Once everybody gets all back and ready. Well, good morning then. Uh, yeah, I would... Yeah, um... I, I, don't, I don't know, do we wait? Do we wake up Donnerwich? Well, I mean, you've been with him. Fuck out. Well, I'm not waiting to bury the kids, so she slips underneath your legs. What? Yeah, Let's go, Derek. You go ahead and talk to the uh, father. I'm going to assist them uh -huh. with the wait. wait, wait. No, no, no. I s shouldn't Donovich like do the burial better? Well, you're a cleric, right? Why don't you're you come pray for him? Aren't you? And I'm a I do have a shovel, and I'm very curious. Well, I'm not a necromancer. Okay, sure. But nah, I, we should tell Donovich what happened. I'm not going to leave the church. Wait, let me let, let me knock on Donovich's door. Why don't I stay in the church while you preside over the burial of the children? Because they deserve to be put to final rest. I agree. Yes. Knock, knock, Wait, knock, knock. Can you hand me the, the, the bodies? Donovich has had a long night. Yeah, he not only he. To, uh, he's knocked the fuck out. <laughs> He's not waking up. Well, and okay. Alright. Uh, I, I mean, we can go. wait with the burial, I think. Let's go. Yeah, they're already leaving. <laughs> God <laughs> damn it. So, I kicked the doors open it. for old time's sake. <sighs> go to the so don't you have the graveyard. Oh, wow. Don't uh, let anyone in if it's not us. And lock the uh, door. Oh. And, and stay hidden. Life, and tell everyone what Most happened. Most of the graves are uh, and open, what considering we. their occupants have gotten up and walked away, thanks to Strahd's influence. Yeah, Derek, uh, don't let anyone except us in. I think we need in. a good burial, not just one random open. Yeah, and, yeah. Uh, we, we might, we might want to consider some stuff too, because they're getting up in the graveyard. Explain what happened okay. and okay. what we are doing. There's an empty plot right there. Goodbye. Or you could... Uh, Set them back in the crypt that was set aside for them. Nah. Yeah. <laughs> nah, it's okay. We're, we're gonna not cussing. We're not them. going back. Yeah, yeah that, that's a door closed. Let's go get that plot. <laughs> yeah, let's go to the plot. Uh, 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 uh. Okay. <laughs> uh, I like the. Where's the entrance? Bodies. Just. Ah. Hop the gate. Okay. It's fine. <laughs> There's entrances on either side of the church there. You just uh, can't oh, see. Okay. Well, oh, shit. I hop the gate. <laughs> <laughs> That's fine. I like the bodies in. The okay, I would like block. to roll perception to look around outside. You may. I will say that this uh, burial will take you about two hours. Oop, that's still my. God damn it. Uh, I, actually, we need bigger, so we dig the plot. Yep. Yep, I'm digging. I'm helping. I have a shovel. Wait, do I? I do. I like Wait. one body in one and the other one next to it. Hey, do I have a shovel? I will let you guys do that while I go solve this issue oh. of whatever yes, the I hell do. it was. Not cash just knocked down in the next room. Oh god. <laughs> Good luck. Uh, I will be right back. Me too. I'll be right back too. You guys pray. Uh, I had a ritual thing somewhere. One moment. Let me check my spell list. Uh, 
Ceremony. There it is. What can I do? Funeral rites. I actually can't do a proper funeral. You touch one corpse and for the next seven days the target can't become undead by any means short of a wish spell. I guess that is good enough roleplay wise. Yeah. Hold on. Yeah. That will take me about uh, one hour plus ten minutes plus an additional ten minutes because it's not prepared. It's a first level spell. So it will take us about two hours and twenty minutes. Uh, one hour and twenty minutes. I could actually prepare them. <laughs> I mean, I am already uh, wearing my vestments. Uh, yeah, it'd be an hour of her body. Body, yep. Yeah. Well, <coughs> I, ha I, oh, I have a. I'll do one body and you do the other body. Well, first of all, who are those children? They were the son and daughter of the parents that were there. They yeah. were ghost children. Do they, they have helped names? Us, by the way. They oh. have Rose and Thorn. Rose yeah. and Thorn, okay. Yeah. Ah, I see a connection, okay. Interesting choice oh, of yes, name. I am here. Hello. I will lay this. Over Welcome back. Back. Something non breakable, thankfully. Okay. Right. Nice. I can Rose <laughs> in. I'll place Rose in the. Uh, yeah, I'm just going to. I can walk off. I can literally make them the descend right into the me. grave. I place Rose in the one to the right of me. All right, give me a sec. Yeah, Parukat, I can actually do a proper like burial ritual. Yeah. With ceremony, I can do funeral okay. rites. I think that's the best I can do. Can you place Thorn in the other one? I got you. Okay. I rest Thorn in the other one. Meanwhile, I am Can doing I I... Uh, the ceremony. Yeah. All past ceremony. Well, that's why you're actually. here. Yes. <laughs> that's why we want you here. Uh, All right. Let me pull out actually, my book even. I actually, before I get up, I like brush my hand on top of Thorn's forehead and like, you know, like a, just like a rest well sort of thing before I back off. I ba Santa fear bows her head. Children of you this world, however old you may be, rest assured that, no pun intended, that you may be resting completely fully in the future if Strat shall be bested and your souls shall finally be able to find eternal peace. For this realm is currently like a flight trap, but you, you already know that by now. Uh, were not for you shall be redeemed. Rest in peace, Amen. Amen. Well, I got I got one thing I gotta just add. Uh, I would like to retcon about your speech. Yeah. Strahd will die. There will be no fact alive when we're done here. Where me and Strahd are alive. Amen. One of us are going down. And uh, thank you guys for your help in the end there. Of course. That, uh, what I could not let these children go without a proper burial. Yeah, well, that was directed at you guys. And also, too, she looks at the kids and goes, thank you for holding the doors open, too, essentially. And she thanks you, too, oh. as well. Like, thank you for making okay. the right happen. Yeah, no, they helped us. Uh, she kind of like fills in yeah, like yeah, like they held. We were go like what we were going through at the end, like jumping through trap doors, and they held the doors open <laughs> for us to get through. Mm, nifty. And the house almost trapped us. So yeah, they're good kids, and oh. yeah, thank you guys for being a part of that too. That uh, that meant a lot to my mental sanity. Well, okay, that was so. one spell slot. Uh, uh, uh child, I believe. Boop. Yeah, 
should I bless? Uh, I mean, they can't no become assist. undead already for the next seven days. Funeral rites. Be the good gods' blessings with you. After the vile curse shall be lifted across these lands. Amen again. Mm -hmm. Now let us pray. And undo the horrific experiences you may have encountered. I'm looking at you, Paroket, and your list of mentality. <laughs> No, 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 I'm not looking at the sanity list at all. <laughs> Don't mind me. No, that's kind of why I snuck in that, hey, that kind of helped my mental sanity sort of thing. <laughs> that's David. Just say That's why I kind of snuck that in there. <laughs> say, I will say this out of everyone here, Xenophia and Kiki are the lowest. Wait, what happened to Darren? <laughs> what happened to me? <laughs> well, yeah, no, we saw it. Like... There's something wrong in his head to begin with. Yeah, That's true too. He, he actually takes half damage because of the lizard brain for sanity. <laughs> I'm not even joking. That's funny. That's awesome. What okay, happened to me? I even prayed. Oh, you, pants. you got some back. Don't worry. Uh, okay. I'm not going to tell you how much you have or what your maximum is. Fair but enough. you are not the lowest. Well, let's pray anyway. If we're if we're gonna pray for our sanity, or if we're gonna do like a group cleansing, let's go back and hit up Derek with it too. Yes, okay. And Valus, what did he do? Why is he tired again? He did a lot. He had a rough time. I'm over the gate next to the uh, entrance did you gate. Almost he die really... again? He always does yeah, that. Yeah, he got he got yeah. absorbed by it. What? <laughs> yeah, it's he disgusting. Got eaten multiple times. <laughs> he did. What? But uh, he gave, he actually he gave me a good battle strategy though in that fight. I'm glad he did what he did. He's a good kid. Oh, I know. I, I he uh, yeah. He is going he, to kill me worrying. He he will. But I'm gonna tell you something. Yes. If I was back at age. He's he, I he, I would want him as my tag team partner. I'm gonna tell you that much. I mean, he's so chaotic. He somehow balances everything out. What we do. We need it. We need a loose cannon to survive this madness. Was that a, was that a madness? Uh, let us pray all together. Did everyone wake up by now after one hour and twenty I would minutes? Like to provide us. Well, I can't provide assistance because I have no religion. Anything in this fuck. He said. <laughs> <laughs> Poor Kiki. <laughs> That's Here just the, that's just the, <laughs> Okay, people, uh, close the, the door and barricade it. We did. Holy I got it. Holy damn. You did the wall pretty ugly, Kiki. Yeah, a, uh, a Goliath taught me that once upon a time. Had a channel into a punch, so... Do you have metal fists or something? That was my nickname. I su uh, Okay, I suddenly feel endangered in my metal armor. It's all right. As long as you're on my side, you have nothing to worry about. She puts a hand on your shoulder. Nothing to worry about. As long as you don't piss me off. That is the third shoulder touch today. Please don't get aroused. I'm not it's used. No, it means what nothing. What, what, what the <laughs> fuck? I meant Anywho. to say I'm not used to this at all. I'm shy. It, it works. It works. It gets attention and it does what it has to do. Anyway, Kiki shouts at the top of her lungs. Damn it! We're praying! <laughs> Kiki Ricky, everyone wake up. No pun intended. Is there just a gust of wind after the shout? <laughs> I would like to check the rooms. Go ahead. I hear nothing for some reason. Paroket is being very quiet. Uh, <laughs> I'm entering Donna Witch's room. He is still passed the fuck out. Okay. I'm entering Irina's room with... What's his name? 
Uh, is Mark. Yep. They are busy packing up their things, getting ready to travel. Okay. Uh, come to us, we wanna pray and uh, cleanse our eventually affected minds. Mm. Mm. Give me a persuasion check. Do I really have to remind you what just happened? Yes. Give me a persuasion check. Okay. A persuasion. <laughs> Ach, you can give me a persuasion check. I like to or assist him with that. You can give me a persuasion check. <laughs> I like to How assist him like with a persu persuasion check. <laughs> How would you like your persuasion check today? <laughs> mm. I got the six. They thank you for the thought, but they've already had to deal with one funeral of their parents. They don't think they could deal with another funeral of some other people they know. Oh, I, I meant just praying normally for ourselves and for what happened and may happen and hopefully may not happen, you know? <laughs> you to keep to a clear him? mind and sane. <laughs> Xanaz just pulls uh, Eel away. Let Kiki handle this. <laughs> you remind no, me bad. of Mina. <laughs> look at the wall. It's a look bad at the idea. Wall. Don't like, say anything. Just actually, look at the she, wall. No, she's like, hey, hey, Kiki, can you come over and keep an eye on Eel? I don't know why. Trying. What so is think, happening here? You saying Kiki's name for some reason made me think you said Kinky for some reason. <laughs> yes, I. What? Oh, oh my god. god. It's like, hello. Come here, Kinky. Who? <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> oh, that explains her outfit choice. Oh. What, <laughs> what uh, a cleric was talking about is just a normal prayer, not anything for funerals or anything. You already did that. Don't worry. You're over there with Kiki. Yeah, Kiki. Uh, if do, do you want me to do you want me to be rough with him, Xana? No. Just Excuse me. <laughs> okay. <laughs> she, gra she grabs your shoulders and just starts like leading you. Away, like, okay, let, let Zana handle this. She she clearly knows what she's doing. I feel like the party got switched out by the same people. We I, I, I kid you not. The fair <laughs> fairy, rest in peace, Mina. Uh, that got enveloped by the mist through the window somehow. And I dumb as fell asleep while seeing that. Uh, my, she... my question, my what? question to you is: Are you coming along willingly? <laughs> we can do this easy or fun. <laughs> so <Fine>. we doing? <laughs> That's my question to you, pal. All right, she takes it by the shoulders before she chicken wings you. <laughs> He's just That's basically not what talking about a normal prayer, like <laughs> one someone would have at a church session. Or others. Not one that you would have a funeral rite prayer. You are welcome to come if you wish. No force. And Zaya just steps out. Punch the wall, Zana. Make a statement. No. Okay. She just offers it to them and leaves. Mm-hmm. If she has right. to roll for religion, I will be sad. <laughs> <laughs> but I'm the holy guy here. You. Yes. Let's go ahead and pray. Okay. Let's come mm -hmm. around the altar, I would say. Uh, let's do that here. Okay, let's do that here in case something is peek uh, peeking through the windows again. By the way, Irina and uh, Ismark, uh, I need you to... Uh, Put on a disguise, by the way. They've already got some disguises. Oh, Unfortunately, I was... they don't have anything too, like, too professional considering the haggard state of the town, but enough for them to be construed as just anyone else, considering they've got mud, dirt, anything to do. Well, good play. thing I got stuff from outside of town, if you may look underneath my mantle. I got a nice collection of. <laughs> no, thank you. You realize that you are basically asking them to look under your cape. Yeah, I don't. No, I'm just you. opening my rope. 
and showing my <laughs> friends. <laughs> I, 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 I'm about to restrain you. Okay. Ravale, Ravale, this is the whole what are you going to fight a robber with conversation again. <laughs> oh, no, yeah. I mean okay. like the Resident okay. Evil trader. Okay. okay. Anyway, I got some out, uh, outside stuff if you Let's may would pray. like to take a look inside. Pray. I got a few okay, capes. Then. I got a... where is everything? Uh, I got a few Cult of the Dragon outfits. I got some... You grab your shoulders Hawk again. Royal Guard. Oh, yes. Are I we got, playing? I got some leather. Um, Give it a, a red, moment. Let me check your thing here. I got a red bandit cape, a red necromancer rope. Uh... You do not have an actual disguise kit, though. No. But actual clothes. Um, Rivale. Yes. Give me one sec here. I want to check something. Uh, I also got some uh, nice Dragon Guard armor. I was about to say, would you like to hand that off to your paladin since they can use that? <laughs> Why? Is that medium armor? You're not using it. <laughs> And it's it? better armor. It's medium armor. <laughs> your paladin succeeding might lead to your survival. Uh, <laughs> armor class yeah, 15. Got armor medium. Other than that, it's it's just a fucking magical breastplate sitting in your loot bag. I mean, you are not fighting a dragon yet. The fire dragon. Ravale, so are yes. you going to use it? Not now. Then hand it off to someone who can. Probably that not use this campaign either. Sure, take a look. I'm gonna take a look at his. Uh, I also uh, got a beaver pelt if someone wants to wear it. So uh, my idea was to disguise you as part of our adventure group. Okay. Also, I got my old leather helmet if someone would like to wear it to cover their face. And a cape, red. Don't mind this one. This one is a little bit dusty and uh, burned, but don't don't, uh, don't ask what happened. Uh, stuff happened. What I'm saying it is it would just equivalent being equal to what armor I'm wearing anyway. It's six would be plus sixteen armor anyway, which I'm wearing already. Just with the advantage of having. Uh, against breath weapons. No, yeah, every little bit helps. Mm hmm. You never know. You never know what you're going to come up on. I mean, I mean I, because. I, would you like to. Would you like me to lend it to you? Uh, you could if you want to. I, I mean, mean, if you're not using it. I'll take a look at wearing it and see what happens. You might gain some effectual ones on it, too. Well, well I'll see. <laughs> I'll have to see this. I mean, uh, I'm okay with it, and I'm not going to dispute the voices. <laughs> uh, sure. Take I, one piece of Dragon Guard I, for the time being. I, I am going to speak OC and to say sometimes what's good for the goose is good for the gander. So like sharing with your party. Good idea. Usually <laughs> somebody else can use it. I know. I noticed that last session. Yep. Just like, you they, know, it, we're on the same team. Give them the same AC they have now, but they won't have a uh, stealth disadvantage. Nice. What? Nice. Yeah, you won't have stealth disadvantage. Yep. It also weighs less. It's mm -hmm. a technical medium armor, but it's a plus one to AC. Well, I'll so be done. sixteen. Uh, oh yeah. Okay. Okay. I'll take that then. Yeah. It's essentially a magical side grade to what you already have. Mhm. Mm so now we actually stealth is an option for everyone. Yep. Yeah, except for your cleric, but oh, I don't well. need yeah. to stealth. I'm intimidating enough. You yep. do not you see me. The overlord. I actually, it drops my AC by one though. I mean, you don't oh, have to wear it. I, I can just keep uh, it for uh, the uh, moment. It, it, it drops. It drops the. I can now stealth without disadvantage. So. It's up to you. 
it's up to you, man, how you want to play. You know, do you want the the one AC or do you want the, it's up to you, you know, whatever, how, I whatever you play. I have a three plus one AC, so I could. It's oh, up to you. you. Yeah. Okay, uh, so yeah, uh, Irina and Ismark uh, disguise as adventurers, uh, invent names for yourselves and uh, who you wanna be. Because as much as I understand, Strats doesn't know exactly how many adventurers there are, maybe? And will get you to a safe place, okay? Wait, wasn't no, there a woman crying in the alley yesterday or something? Also, we'll have to de uh, we have to decide what we do with the sun. But now, let us pray together. Yes. I would like to do roll we, for religion. Do Do we want to hold hands while we do this? We can make it stronger. Stronger. I'm not. Can I do your roll with religion for advantage as well? Yeah, Thank buddy. You. One moment. That was a twenty-two. Let's do it again. Uh, I'll take the first one. A twenty-two. Okay, Not bad. So breastplate gives normally 14. Mm -hmm. So it did already come. Uh, yep. Add in the plus one. Yep. Yeah. It drops they lose a single one, thing of AC, but eh, they're at 18 AC. That's still very good for. Mm -hmm. what is it? Yeah. I'm Level immune eight. to crit, so. Mm -hmm. Yep. It's not a bad stat. Okay, bad I thing. got a 22. What does it do? Twenty-two. <laughs> Let me look at my little list. And everyone happy and motivated, feeling refreshed. Trevale, you have yes. one favor from your god thanks to this role and the fact that you have essentially gotten a following even if it is only technical oh as of right now da, 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 da. I will let you know the change that occurs but as of right now you have not noticed it but your god has changed something nice oh okay <laughs> nice. nice. I guess there is some sort of connection. I'm not bitching. <laughs> okay, well, uh, I am good to go. Uh, we need to wake you up Donovich. We leave this place as soon as possible. <clears throat> well, we have two options, I feel, if we're really going to talk about going. We do got to get these two away from here, but yes. there is a loud disturbance that's been going on since we got here. The Wailing Woman. Yes. What what do we think as a group? Wake up, do we the woman or we skip it? Wake up, Donovich, deal with the problem here in the church and then uh, think about outside stuff. I mean, do you want to... I mean, I don't want to exhaust him either. I mean, he seems like he's pretty out of it. I would like to check let on the him, basement door. Let him, let him sleep. Mm -hmm. We're young. Okay. We can do this. We can we can put an impact on something. So I, I say want to handle his son yet because I want him. Oh yeah, that's a good point. People, he, one he more should... important thing to mention: Radan told. Uh, what is the word? Uh, explicitly or something. Told him, uh, told Donald Witch to not help us further than he is supposed to. So we shouldn't oh, yeah, he, be this guy too like, off he sounds, too long here inside the church. Yeah, I mean, we shouldn't. We should probably get going soon, but I feel like we have one thing hanging here. So that's why I'm asking: do we do we attack what we're with the last thing here, or are we going to just move on? Essentially, I just want to see what the party feels because. Either one, I feel like, is a good option. We help the wailing woman. I mean, there's a, there is a child missing, technically, which me, I feel strongly about helping children. So, I mean, I do want to check in on it. A missing child. Yeah, the wailing. There's wailing a wailing woman. Child. Yeah. Run, well, yeah. Run away, essentially. She okay. did. I would like to check the trap door first. Don't mess with the door. 
I'm not going to touch it. I just wanna check if it's still holding, and we can uh, 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 leave Donovich alone with him. I, uh, okay. Uh, Rocket, I think I need to roll for perception. I'm just in the room with him. I'm ready to react. That's all. Ah, I had an eleven almost. What is with my perception here? Hey, come on. Would you like to use your roll or your passive? Whichever is higher. Your yeah, passive, passive perception is a 14, and what exactly are you trying to notice here? If the trap door or, and the room is safe enough to leave Donovich alone with his uh, son here. It is securely shut with chains and locks, as well as the fact that the trap door itself, after having been wet, if I change the map here, because I forgot to do that. <clears throat> yes, sir. Oh, okay. As you can see from the water in the room, yes. the trap door itself has warped and is now securely stuck after soaking up water, warping, and essentially becoming formed around the opening. It would take great force to open this. And from what you know, his son is still down there, and while he won't die, he is severely starved of blood, so probably very weakened. I feel yes. we deal with this once Donovich is up. I think he should see his son yeah, one more yeah, time before yeah, we put him in. I'm not going to uh, cure his son without his presence. Um, yeah. And surprise him. Congratulations! You have been uh, relieved of your heavy burden. Here's the bill. I wouldn't. I wouldn't say that out loud. You can keep that one to yourself. Mm. That was a metaphor. <laughs> I'm just not actually that. going to do that. My God! Just pat your chest. You keep that to yourself. You just did you I wish I your condolences. Why do you like did to I pet me so that. much? Did I hear oh. him talk about you? What he just said about you being cleared of your heavy button? Don't take me uh, word for word always. Please, thank you. I, listen. I'm yes. just trying to help coach you because we had a really big mess up at the tavern. I'm just trying to coach you. That's oh all. my god. That's all I'm doing. That's all. I'm just, I'm not telling you what to do. I'm just saying you can make the blow soft. That is very strange because Mina was always, almost doing the same always. E I could see why. I almost <laughs> started to call her mother. Imagine that. What? She would have just turned around, looked at you. At, at, this is out of character. She would just turn around, money, looked huh? at you, and just do that. I don't even know. Am I wrong though? No. I, no. 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 Listen. Yeah, she, yeah, Kiki, I mean, like, yeah. Grabs your shoulder. Just, just like looking at you. Just like, I get it. I know because I feel the same way. You but have nice has... eyes. Okay, this is not the time to flirt with me. Okay, <laughs> just say <laughs> what? <laughs> what? Oh, oh, <laughs> it's time to flirt with me. Okay, I'm not good. At that, guys, are we going? Yes, we're going. <laughs> Thank you. First, it was fucking Saren with the hands on the shoulders. Now this. <laughs> but, no, first it was Donna. It was Domino with oh, and then on the first in the first set it can't be. Now it's. Freaking Kiki with a hand on it, and then no. it's my chemist. Okay, aggressive. I have Kiki's no chemist. Just like no, no, no. But Kiki's just very aggressive. I'm just letting y'all know she would grab anyone to get her way. Not like that, but <laughs> basically, she would almost be like how Mina was, you know, to correct people in a way. Essentially, she gets her point across when she like, you know, when she does that like physical interaction. I almost can see a hole through the wall. On this side yeah, of the that room. Was, that was almost your head. Now let's uh, go. Oh <laughs> shit. Why did you burst into the door like that? Like, and she's gone. Never mind. Why did you Where? almost. Okay. Why did you attack our party member? <laughs> well, maybe because I thought it's a vampire that has maybe uh, looked like. Hmm, that didn't buy the story of Donovich after all? I don't know. I almost smited you. Do you realize <laughs> vampires have to 
ask before entering. Yeah, entering, but maybe well, not to that. put their <laughs> hand through the door or something. I don't know. I'm not I taking any risks. I didn't put my hand through the door. I walked in. Yeah, listen, I kicked After the door. In. That was my bad I thought you smashed the door. I'm sorry. I'm not I taking any risks. The door. I don't know. Yeah, Zan, what's anyway, wrong with you? I wanna uh, tell Arena and Ismark again to make up a name. Maybe tell us now in case we meet the vampire or a vampire and uh, tell him if you have to that we are with uh, uh, Shrekken, Thought, and Dillivin or something. Could I? Harukat, actually... this is your turn. <laughs> <laughs> Give us names. All right. All right. They are all ready to go whenever you are. I was actually going to ask, could is there any chance that we can convince? I know he's not here, but since he's not playing right now, is there any way we can have Valis kind of like just take guard on this one, like come into the church? Because of what uh, what EL has told us, yes. at least having a single one word out of Valis's mouth as he looks at you all, Bernie. Actually, yes, <laughs> damn Venom Valos. If something goes out uh, south, uh, survive, please, and uh, that's deal with the vampire if necessary. Burn everything. Got it. You, that is the fastest I think I've 180 on anything at all. Okay. Like, this is a good idea. This is a bad idea. This is awful. People, that reminds me. Uh, let us refill our poultices. Okay. So you were filled. Here, here's my empty poultices. You do that, Valis. You burn the vampires, the bad guys. Nobody else, not the church. Vale. Yes. Give me a perception check. Oh shit. <laughs> Can I assist him with? Ah, come on. Why perception always no. so low? Give me one more check. Ah, better. Twenty. He stole my poultices, I know that. I'm going to send you something in Discord. They have cold legs and run away. Okay, what Your mace has it? changed. <gasps> uh oh. It oh, is no. no longer a glowy mace that you know. Wait, what? Well, what the fish happened to my mace? Wait. I'm holding up my mace. And I'm like... Huh? Due to the fact that you seemingly now have a following in Sylvanas' eyes, he managed to claim the weakened relic of Lathander, Lightbringer. Uh-oh. Why don't you read out loud what uh, Nature's Glow is in your equipment now? Oh, wait. Uh, let me show this it on the exact stream. same thing plus one thing. <laughs> This is how it looks like. Oh, this like. is a cantrip. Okay, one moment. Uh, refresh. Okay. <clears throat> Nature's glow. Uncommon weapon mace. Cantrip druid craft at will. Casting time one action. Instantaneous. Whispering to the spirits of nature, you create one of the following effects within range. Weather sensor. You create a tiny harmless sensory effect that predicts what the weather will be at your location for the next 24 hours. The effect might manifest as a golden orb for clear skies, a cloud for rain, falling snowflakes for snow, and so on. This effect persists for one round. Blue. You instantly make a flower blossom, a seed pot open, or a leaf but bloom. Oh. Sensory effect. You create a harmless sensory effect such as falling leaves, spectral dancing fairies, Mina, <laughs> a gentle breeze, <laughs> the sound of an animal, or the faint color of skunk. The eff wow. The effect must fit in a five foot cube. Fire play. You light or snuff out a candle, a torch, or a campfire. Essentially put, wow. 
Your Lightbringer has been claimed by Sylvanas thanks to the fact that you now have a following in his name, for all intents and purposes. Okay. Claim this weakened relic because since you arrived in Barovia, anything connected to the god of mourning, Lathander, became weakened like you saw. I see what you did there, okay. That, and it is also a personal thing, because now any light you have is a green glow which can be construed as necromantic. Ah, oh, come on. <laughs> <laughs> it's the glow of nature. Uh -huh, sure. Yeah, okay. I for a bonk. But the only real thing it gives you is your radiance damage back and the druidcraft cantrip. That is about it. Oh. But yes, you now have a green glowing mace like any other good death Oh my god, I am not school now. <laughs> you have been doing very good work for Sylvanas, and believe me, I'm keeping a check on uh, how much work you're actually doing for your god. Dude. Thank you, I like to roleplay. Dude, yeah, right? Dude, Sylvanas got a really fucked up sense of humor. Yeah, dude, we all see this green glow. Yes, you see. Huh. You don't see the actual uh, mace change. If you'd like to show them the picture that I sent you, you may. It no longer looks like the. Watch my stream. Rising sun. I have it open. Don't have. It should be in oh, the I... personal DM I sent you. Oh, I'll, I'll do this through Discord. Yes. Uh, one moment. Oh, it went from a golden sunburst to this. Yes, into a flower. <laughs> right, let me. So it's me. Copy. Copy. Sylvanas does find this funny. Don't you worry. I this hope, is my character. I hope <laughs> Laventa... <laughs> Necromancer, but I it's hope fine. Laventa doesn't take offense. Okay, there it is, is now sitting in our group chat for you. Instead yes. of a golden sunburst, it is a golden flower. Oh my god. Bling bling, what can I say? I like it. So... Uh, you said I take, oh. I get back the uh, radiant damage too? Yep, you are now back up to regular damage for this. Okay, but it's still only for undead and wild lit, yes? Yep. Okay. Essentially put, it's no longer drop the dice. Because okay. Sylvanas looked at this, just, oh, see, Sylvanas looked at this and went, I'm going to have to keep track of this. Fuck it. <laughs> okay, so <laughs> that and I looked at the number of points he has accrued for religion, and I went, "You know what? He's actually earned something." Uh, does the mace keep my heavy modification? Yes. Oh, I did not add that in because okay. that was a personal thing that was added in. Yes, one moment. Let me do it again. Uh, damage. Wait, yes, damage bonus plus. Wait, I need the site again. I thought I think that was plus two bludgeoning. Uh, you do uh, you do realize? Yes, <laughs> you are. <laughs> what? There's no way you're talking yourself out of being a necromancer <laughs> at this point. Oh, <laughs> you, Your weapon you got... does get an additional plus two de bludgeoning damage. <laughs> it loses the light orphaness property and gains the heavy property. Yes, yes, heavy and uh, plus two bludgeoning. <laughs> We're, we're making sure he's never beaten the allegations. Weapon mod, <laughs> there it is. Uh, what are you? I'm a life cleric. Giant <laughs> spiky armor, red glowing eyes, and a green glowing mace. Nafgul uh, colored mace. Sure, whatever you uh, say, bud. Those two platinum. Yes, okay. <laughs> I am so glad in like session three, I made the session, accusation uh, as another character. One, two. Even God's yes. in on the joke now. <laughs> <laughs> Even God needs a laugh. Are you joking like, this about is one of my, This is one of my best missionary guys. But honestly, this is too <laughs> funny not to play it up. So here you go. Let's fuck with them. <laughs> Why are you testing me like this Sylvanus? Oh, there's no test. It's just enjoyment. Wow. You've already passed the test. Don't worry. This is just fuckery. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> it gets boring up here. Okay. So uh, that was that. Nice. Thank you. Be all hail Sylvanus, god of nature, uh, keeper of ultimate balance and protector of the world. 
Uh, All right. Arena and no, uh, uh, what's his name again? Ismark. Wait, I can't move his name. Ismark. Yes. Ismark. Irina and Ismark. Uh, tell us who you are in disguise so that we know now. Ismark's gonna be Patrick, and Irina will be. Poyara. Okay, now who are you? Like, mm. are you sisters? Are you foreigners? Are you uh, they are brothers paladins? Sister. Fighters? Who are you? <laughs> what uh, fighters? Not. Fighters. They're okay. Essentially, muscle for your team. Okay, fighters. Uh, are you siblings? They are actual siblings. So yes. You are oh. actual siblings, okay. Well. Yes, they are. No one knows anything else. <laughs> well. <laughs> oh, see, well. Okay. That's um, God make... has been kind. Do not make God mad. <laughs> no, I'm just, that... Kind for us to go. Okay. Uh, would you like any extra outfits? I have a collection in my pockets. I'm they going are all set to go. Keep an eye on him. Okay. Why me? He Maybe just, no, a lesser you, helmet to no, cover a face. Keep an eye on him. I will you know what, this gonna... here and now, though. Yes. Take a vote whether or not you guys want to go to the abbey or the town. The abbey and the town are both walled. The town itself is sitting in the middle of the valley, if I remember correctly. So it's in an open area, so it can't be snuck up on. But the abbey is sitting in a mountainous area, which is very hard to get to. At least if you're trying to sneak. Hmm. We only have one problem with sneaking, but <laughs> I'm, <laughs> I'm leaving it up as the junior member. I'm leaving it up to the senior members of the crew. I'll actually, that would be me and Valus. Uh, actually, I, I was voting to go to, to hear the Wailing Woman. We will do that after. That I mean, yeah, we will uh, p uh, bring them to safety afterwards. I don't think we will ever return here, will we? That's up to you. You could. I mean, okay. Um, I, but maybe then the woman is not crying anymore and the mission is uh, lost. Okay, Varus protect the church. Bernie? Yes, Bernie. Uh, tell Kira, to tell Kari to behave. Uh, and we go. To the lady, I guess. Alright. So we'll have I to go will... back again. Yeah. And Give yeah, you... where, where do we bring them now? Uh, we haven't decided yet. They're in the carriage. Yep. Oh, they're still in. Don't mind me, I'm just drawing stuff here so you guys actually know where the places are in relation so, to and distance wise. Yeah, that would be nice. So the Abbey and town. I think the town is over there. That is the castle. And the Abbey probably somewhere in the mountains. Which is not on the map, by the way. But yeah. Um, do I have to reload? Mm. No kitty. Okay. Um, so, town better protected, but Abbey less stealthy approachable. Yes? Actually, Golaki would be over here near the lake, so it's... It is technically in the open area, but it's surrounded by forest, but it's got some open area around it. There? LOL! There's, okay. There's Valaki. And yes. where was the Abbey? I mean, I see the I mountains. There. Have I gone past it? I think I have. Ah, there it is. It is... Is that it? Nope. It's going to be further to the west. Is that it? Is there a hole? Or is that the mine? I, I don't know. There's an A for the Abbey. A and the... Mm. So it's it's there. Yeah! I saw... I th yep. Are those mountains? Yep. Oh. Like I said, it's in a mountainous area, but Valaki is on the way. But you see where it is. You know, from what everybody's been telling you, that this right here is the castle. 
Yes. Mm, I would almost decide to go to Valakia first, just check out the situation, and then maybe decide to go to the Abbey. After all. Think about the Abbey. What do you think? That was my idea. I would actually counter that with Abby first. I mean, is yeah, the Abby safer? It'd be so harder to get to the net to get to the Abby. To get into the Abby. Nope. Damn it, uh, Brickbaker, what do you think? You mean... Kiki. Kiki. David and Kiki, <laughs> what do you think about our thoughts? I'll bring you guys back to the town here. But yes, that is the distance that you have towards your two spots that were noted. The yes. Lockie and the Abbey. I mean, I'm all for taking the stealthier approach if we ever could. But again, we have a glancing issue with stealthing. So, I mean, not naming any names, not na not pointing out, but yeah, it's just <laughs> there, somebody might throw out the stealth game. We have one really good stealther and one that's, yeah, you know, I can change armor by the way. Uh -huh. It will take me five minutes. Of the choices, the Abbey is the one that ha gets her furthest away from Strahd. Yes. Mm hmm. I'd prefer her to be further away from Strahd than close. What do Kolyatha and anywhere within these Peter uh, think? Thing, but they're fine with either so long as they get away from Strahd because they're literally right in front of Castle Ravenloft. They can literally see the castle from where they are by this church. Well, as a junior member, I will leave it up to my senior members to decide. I'm just, making my two, I'm just declaring my two cents. And the farther the, away from Strahd, the, probably the better. Is it safer? I'm going to apologize now if the sound of the rain puts you to sleep, Shadow. Oh, that's, that's fine. David, you seem to be very... Wise, uh, what are your thoughts? I already said what I, my, what I thought was better. Because, like I said, they want to get as far away from Strahd as possible. The best one that sounds to me, then, is the Abbey, so it's further. I agree, the Abbey is farther. I mean, okay, if two people say Abbey, I would say Abbey, too. And I guess it's so decided. Abby. If so it's Abby. actually well, safe so if enough. It's in the mountains, yeah. Well, I mean, I get the I get the distinct feeling that nothing is secret here, but the farther no. the better. Yes. So let's take care of that wailing woman, I suppose. Then we get out okay. of here. And very important, we don't tell Donovich anything. It's safer for him. And Let's less information that could be forced out of him. E e All we do is we ask him about his son. And that's it. And then sorry, we just say we go. Zara's so gonna grab her, his, uh, I mean, like, sh a shoulder. Let's worry about that later. Yes. Let's handle this woman that you've. Yes told about her runaway daughter or child so Kiki may you tell us where she is do you know where she is I'm going to exposition all information that I know about it uh, I know it's in the southern building though let me pull my notes mm, giant red M yes I thank you <laughs> <laughs> I knew it was the southern <laughs> building so but I had to go ahead and go out yeah, uh, for some reason, he has a shop or something. Hey, there, mm -hmm. Just hang, hang, hang back a sec, though, Derek, before he vanish from my sight. And I have some sort of beat on you. Valos, keep watch. Lock the doors. 
like and a weeping no angel. Can... So long as I look at you, you can't move. Yes. <laughs> you are stayed in your position. You can't kill anything. <laughs> All right. D uh, fucker. <laughs> uh... <laughs> Give me a perception check. I'm going for it. I'm rolling it. All right, motherfucker. <laughs> Considering you were just looking at him, you will get advantage. You were okay, literally so staring at him, watching him just double middle finger you and disappear. <laughs> uh, no, it's 23 is the highest. I don't think that's going anywhere. Nope. As you stare at Derek, all you see is two slow middle fingers, and he just <laughs> you blink, and he's fucking gone. God damn it. It's twice. <laughs> what happened to you? Uh I don't even... What happened I to you and David? Mean, meanwhile, I don't even want to talk about it right now. I don't I want do, to talk about it, man. I do not even care right now. All right, look, okay. I'm going. People, do you think I and Fuck they are this. gone? <laughs> and just like Valus, that, he actually looks at some fucking locks the door sanity. and wait. Let me give Valus <laughs> yeah. uh, poultices again. How many is he lacking? Oh, I yeah. you actually gain some back. Yeah, thanks for undoing this. Well, you're the one that decided to challenge him. <laughs> well, so, I had a quest. I, I wanted to talk you. to you. I just, just oh, you go, said look. don't move. I got to keep my eye on you. No, I oh, said God. I want to talk to you before you disappear. And you just fucking vanish. I'm like, all right, asshole. Just like, oh, I, you think you have me? Ta -da! No, you don't. <laughs> 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 Look at this fucker! You Two middle fingers and disappear. Uh, all, all you that gotta remember, you are talking to a lizard, so he oh, took yeah. it as a challenge. I can no, you got your eye on me. I cannot okay, wait until you now. I cannot wait until you're visible again. But all you see <laughs> on your goddamn Xbox pop-up is Kiki will remember that. <laughs> <laughs> oh fuck! Yeah, I gotta pee after that. Yeah. All right. I would like to give Valus. Uh, Poultices again up to 10. 10 poultices? Well, for him to have 10 again. Let me see how much he's got at the moment. Yes, please. Kiki, did you, give, uh, you too. Did you give Xana any poultices? Xana, um, I, I'll give you two. 10. Please say heal for 1d8. I don't even think he added his poultices from before. Uh. Uh, so okay. traveling Custom church, item. healing poultice, minus 10, 1, 2, three. One, two three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. yes. Motherfucking custom item. Uh, oh, yep. Kiki, how much are you missing? How many are you missing? Oh, he went now, okay. David, are you David? Where is he? <laughs> like, I've got. Wait, where is everyone? Are you missing any poultices? While we are at the carriage. Hello, horses. He knows We're where probably to find alone the talking to the horses. You're my only friend, horsey. Check out my new maze, people. Okay. I'm um, get to Man Mary's thing. Oh god. <laughs> Just the whole fuck you, I'm disappearing. The 1d8 plus 3? Just 1d8. Okay. Alright. Just 1d8. So, the boarded up, barricaded from the inside house. Um, 40 feet square. Kiki, are you back? From. What you can tell nope. okay. mm -hmm. that the crying is coming from the second floor. Okay. Do I know where they went? Did they tell you? Can I give a perception to see if there's an actual way open? Somewhere south. Sure. That's all you know. Wait, they uh, Kiki acquisitioned everything to us, so I guess she also uh, told okay. us. Where is the shop? Do I know? I think I know. Yes, I know where the shop is. I was there. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I hope you did come with us to the shop. You have a very bad habit of not following the group. 
Yeah, the crew do. has a very bad habit, uh, habit of just running a force. All right. So with your perception check of 10, you do not see any other way in. All the windows and doors are boarded from the inside, meaning essentially you could push on them and they'll pop out. Is this a building? Hmm. Oh, wait. Is that the building with Sanafia standing in front? Yes. Okay. So I'm going to Let go me ahead lock. and push. Lock. One sec, oh, wow. Okay. She's doing something. Oh. I'm... Hmm. If our scout was here, I'd have him take a look and see if there was an... <laughs> I would like to <laughs> knock. For some reason, I am staring at you like I'm right here. Yes. Uh, there, wherever you are, please, could you take a look, see if there's a way in where we don't have to push down anything? Now, if I remember from my earlier reconnaissance, there isn't. Mm -hmm. All right, so is Santa's going to go ahead and push on the uh, front door. Okay, Give I would... me a strength check. I would like to knock. Strength check. Okay. There's no door. Everything's just boarded up. Fifteen. I would like to knock anyway. There's no oh, there's... answer. The crying's still going on. It can't be... Your knocks can't be heard over it. I, I don't think there's going to be a door there for that, you. That is suspicious. Yes. <laughs> I have you my hand on my mace. If... Alright. So you managed to knock down the board... The, the boards that are in place of the, where the front door would be and are now inside the house on the ground floor. Okay, Kiki, you go in first. You are the most beautiful here. Will you stop? Xana's already, <laughs> already in. You say, where and are you going with this? Xana here looks like a vampire, okay? I, I look really like a vampire. You Damn have red glowing eyes. Like and Damn it, you, you can't see Devin at all. <laughs> Says the one who looks like a literal heavy armored necromancer. All right, Derek. In the ground floor, yes. you see that like most things seem to I be uncared for. You seem, you see that most things seem to be uncared for, rather dusty. But there's a pair of pair. There are stairs going up to the second floor. <laughs> Where the fuck pair of something am I going to have you go up? Jesus Christ. <laughs> a pair of uh, ropes. <laughs> a pair of fucking it's... squeaky clown shoes. Nobody knows what Derrick is. It... Jesus. <laughs> <laughs> I would like to check the surroundings before I enter. Alright. Then we'll go up to the second floor. Why? Why are my perceptions so low? What are you doing fireworks? It's almost midnight. Huh. <laughs> I knew it. <laughs> Don't worry One about moment. it. One moment. Are you crazy, fish? One moment. Hold on a second. I call Stone of Truth. No, wait. Uh, not Truth. Uh, magic Circle. God damn it, he disappeared. Wait. <laughs> Uh, where's that here? Where okay. is the cleric? People, we have a vampire. Chase! You didn't see that one. <laughs> people, <laughs> people, we are being followed. We're all in. Sorry. <laughs> yeah, well, people, I... Yeah. We... yeah, there was a man I fought at age one time. The you know what his special fight. ability was? <laughs> He would do splits and punch people in the crotch. I will do this to you. <laughs> if you flirt with me or stay behind, get in here. But vampire, hello? <laughs> then it's going to step out and pull heel in. I already come inside, but there is a vampire outside tailing us. Why about there's a, it? Later. There's a vampire everywhere here. Okay. What Think do we know? Where we are at. Think. Bovaria. But we are right at, now being we're, we're, tailed. Is... There's vampires all over this place. Are you a vampire? That reminds me. Let me give you holy water too. 
All right, how many holy, how much holy water? One. It's a normal item. Uh, ten. Ten oh, holy water is okay. Scratch. Yes. Equip a scratch. Oh. All. No, all you can't play water. with the keyboard. How much do I have? How much do I have on me and everywhere else? Yeah, okay. Anyways, Let me give I'll you 10. Upstairs. Yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm going up too. 10 oh, for my belt. Right. How the so, funsies? <laughs> da, da, da. So, you see two those bedrooms, 10 holy water. Which, you see two bedrooms, one of which is... The door on it is broken open. The other one is opened, and you can tell that the crying is coming from the one that isn't broken. Uh, so okay, so there's the crying's coming from that's not broken. Are uh, you? Doing are you threatening there? me, Master Dungeon Master? No, I'm just saying your perception check as you're seeing things. <laughs> I am not seeing Paranoia. things. Why does no one care? Time. Why? Are you heading into that bedroom then, Derek? Yep. Can I look you around see, the house? I, I'm heading to. One sec. You see in the center of that bedroom is a old woman clutching a malformed doll. She is crying and cradling the doll and rocking back and forth, seemingly lost in her sorrow and despondency. I want to look around the entrance. Call Mary? She does not react at all. She looks around but sees no one and simply goes back to crying. Well played. <laughs> Garrett, maybe console her a little bit. Reassure her. I guess. You're asking the little lizard to do this? Okay, Zana. Zana. <laughs> Let's Can have I... the uh, lizard with sharp teeth just pop out of nowhere and go, hello. <laughs> hey, I don't discriminate in heroes. Can I look there. around there the entrance? Go up to her. Then it's going to go up to Hello? She looks up and sees you. She's still crying, but she is focused on you. Come here, ask what, what's, what, what's wrong? She shakes her head and clutches her doll even tighter, rocking back and forth, still sobbing. I'm coming up to... You may be able to help if you let us know. She looks up at you at that and continues to watch you. We we would like to know and help if any way we can. You see her flip the doll around to look at its face. And you'll see her pull a tag off the back of the doll and essentially hold it out for you as she clutches the doll in her hand. Still rocking back and forth, sobbing. Do I see a name on the tag? You see some writing. Okay. To my dearest daughter, Gertruda, may this toy from my youth bring you happiness that it did not bring to me. Is this your daughter? What? You see, stitched into the hem of the dress is a sort of strange sentence it says is no fun is no blinsky ouch <laughs> yeah I'm what's wrong with my pancakes <laughs> what blinsky oh wait do you mean the swear word never mind what eh it's a name. Blinsky is a name. <laughs> oh, I thought you was, that was, was supposed to be a Russian word. <laughs> I bet it sounded so Russian. Is your daughter gone? 
my brain just stopped and I went, <laughs> Yeah, I was what? like, what? <laughs> what? I actually had to look at the whiskey in my hand and go, have I hit the limit? <laughs> you actually, I, I, I haven't even had half of my glass of whiskey and I'm sitting there going, am I losing it? What the fuck? Yeah, it does sound like a potato. It does sound, I know what you mean, though. It sounds like the uh, the potato pancake, though. What the fuck, whatever we call it. Blini in the Russian. Yeah. 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 But then I thought I you maybe meant to swear word. My brain just stopped going, am I an alcoholic? <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> okay, okay. Sorry, my All bad. Right. Blinsky is Shrinkless. the name of a toy maker here. Oh. And it's spelled B-L-I-N-S-K-Y. Oh my god, it's not a quality MMS product. Day. Now I get it. It's not Blinsky, <laughs> okay. Just DM it to me, because I'm going to forget it. <laughs> Seven, take notes. Somebody... I'm not the one taking charge. I'm not taking notes. It's not my nope. conversation. <laughs> I'm your narrator. <laughs> <laughs> All right. But from what you can tell, as you ask her if this was her daughter's, she nods her head back and forth. And from what you can tell... Da, 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 da. From what she haltingly tells you in a broken voice, which I'm not even going to try to attempt because I like my throat. <laughs> her, her daughter Gertruda lived in this house with her for her entire life, but as she grew up and became a teenager, she broke out of the house a week ago and has not been seen since, and her mother thus fears the worst. Oh, I am deeply sorry. We can go try to look for her. I'm just Thank standing beside the know. doorway on the other side of the room, not showing myself, let him just listening. Mm -hmm. we'll I would like to, to go you. down, maybe, and close the door again. We'll try to find your daughter if we can, possible. And she bows her head and she walks down the stairs. I knew it. If you want to speak to her, you might want to be careful. Yeah, be gentle with her. I'm gonna yes. go in. Yeah. I kind of, Kiki kind of pokes her head in and, hi, sweetheart. You feeling okay? I mean, it's a mood She's question. She's still clutching the doll, kind of shaking back and forth. Sanafia. Shaking, I know. Shaking, just shaking, essentially. Sanafia. Okay, sweetheart. Look outside. What does your what does your daughter look like, sweetheart? You know what, Zenithia Rivali, give me perception checks. I'm bad with perception today. An eight. Fifteen. I think the vampire might know something about the missing daughter, or it is the daughter. Ah, <gasps> plot twist. Or you're going crazy. Uh, 15 and 12. Where did I put that? Oh no, is it plot again? <laughs> Maybe. What are you doing, kitten? Stop mauling each other, Jesus. What was that thing he called against? It was called the plot. The blood of some... Here it is. Oh, no, that's not the right one. I will send it later. <laughs> I will let you know what you get. In just a second, as I do my searching, I will let them continue to talk. Apropos, how do we get our new items, by the way? Let me have. <laughs> what the fish? Oh, but I know style, dude, dude. It's a Korean. <laughs> Don't worry about it. Okay. Tasks, <laughs> that was the word. That's all I'm going to say is okay. 
Hang on, wait. Everything's fine. What are you guys doing? Kiki I was asking was talking what to Mary. <laughs> yeah, so Kiki was asking what the daughter looks like and any last traces where she might have went. Like, where does she like to go? Essentially, she looks like the doll. Does she have any favorite hangout areas? Anywhere inside the town, but she hasn't returned home. Has she act been acting strange lately? Ravale, shout yes. out, there it is in our chat. That is what you see outside the window. <laughs> is it the bigger? <laughs> What the fish is it? <laughs> we drank the oh, don't worry. People, it's fine. But the people want dry. <laughs> Kiki would the like to go this one. <laughs> Kiki would like to riz this wizard up. <laughs> oh no, this is just what they're seeing in their uh, poorly made perception roll. What <laughs> At 15 the to poorly, poorly made? Holy shit. <laughs> she knows, but she pays. Kiki, uh, not Kiki, uh, Zana pays no mind to it, and so. <gasps> it's a wizard! Xadafia, that's the wizard we heard of earlier. No, that's just a vampire that drank blood and thinks he's a wizard. Xadafia, it's a you vampire! You essentially see this vampire outside <laughs> doing this. And I will now put this up on stream so everybody can see. I did the same. What happened to my? There it is. Maybe he knows something about it, about the daughter. She looks like. Sanafia. For those of you watching, this is uh, what they see outside. Sanafia. Stay here. I'll go up, tell the others. No, you are staying right here. With me. Good old punky doodles. You, you will stay with me. Okay, stay I stay here, go. you go up and tell them. Oh, I boy. We're not paying attention to that person outside. Uh, why? This is so unfair, the baby is so suspicious. Relax. Relax. I am... And he's even... Dead. Are you kidding me? I am relaxed, but... Is it maybe not you like... Not dangerous? I am focused. If it was, if it was dangerous... If, it, if, if we were any... Probably be in a problem right now. Rivali, give me one more perception check. <laughs> uh, <sighs> thirteen. You realize the v dancing vampire who proclaimed he was a wizard because he drank the dr blood of drugged people was nothing more than a figment of your tired mind. God damn it! I'm too tired for this bullshit. <laughs> Fair <laughs> enough. I was keeping watch all the time. <laughs> Wait, how did you see him then? It's the land of Barovia. Uh. That makes sense. sense. <laughs> Damn you, Strahd! It wasn't me! Ah, ah, ah. But yeah, if anybody else wants to look at that, it's in our group chat just for shits and giggles. <sighs> All right. What are y'all doing now? You've learned what Mad Mary's issue is, but you have no clues as to where her daughter actually went. So how does she look like? Like her doll. Ah, I don't know. I need to see. Believe me, you'll know Gertruda if you see her. Uh-oh. Don't worry about it. Can I watch outside the window again? <laughs> You're going to see the exact same thing, except this time he's under the 
Well, never mind. That's he's definitely male. Okay. Oh, so you did look. Can I come up now? Yep. I'm all set whenever you guys are to head out. I mean, I don't know what to ask. Maybe she has something to tell to a religious person? She's told you all she knows. What's her name again? Mad Mary. And the daughter's name? Gertrude. Gertrude. Okay. Can I look around the corner carefully and say, don't worry, we'll find your daughter? She doesn't respond. She's still shaking back and forth, sobbing. Can I comfort her? Yeah, she's gonna go outside. Can I so pray with her? And she's going can. to take Eel with her. Hey! <laughs> <laughs> I didn't do anything. The shoulder. Hey! Why, uh, Red? Maybe wait, close the door. There is no door. It's just barred. Close she the bar. Up, uh... Xenophys, go back up to the church. Oh, yes, go to the church. Now. You go. Xana is going to put some uh, boards on the wall of the hole as much as she can. Tell her, tell her that she needs to go to the Just church and go, that we will go. bring the daughter also to the church. Go, go. For her as a motivation to go to the church. Are you, hey, as an idea, okay? Tell her. I know. She she knows we told uh, Okay. Alright. So we should head off now if we have no idea where Okay, where is Blinsky? Uh oh. You do not know where Blinsky is. L let's ask where Blinsky is. You're asking where the toy maker Blinsky is. Yes. Is he outside well, of Bavaria? In... He is in Barovia, but he's not in this town. Okay, I had the idea that maybe the daughter like went to the toy maker to get a better toy. I don't know. Maybe she has a lover. Let's ask around the tavern. All right. Or do we head out? Out. Say, so which way do you guys want to go? Do you want to go to the next town or the abbey? We should try to see if... Is there anyone at the tavern at this moment? Not as of right now, considering they just had the vampire scare not that long ago. Yeah, true. Uh, <laughs> Damn it. <laughs> They're like, nope, we're, look this. We're not going to be able to ask anyone around town What about, about the shop uh, guy? You stay here. I'm going to go talk to this. But not alone. I'm... Take Derek with you. Where? Who? Where? Derrit. Somewhere. <laughs> exactly. He, he is Where? everywhere and nowhere. Derrit is our scout, by the way. He is a lizard. I folk. I know. I've met Derrit. Oh. He wasn't in the, invisible to the eye. Sure, okay. yeah, but go with him and go with God. I think... Hmm. Amen. Kiki, are you doing anything? Or do you want to keep an eye on... Uh, Amen. Uh, you, you're going to the... What do you say you're doing? You're going to the tavern to do what? No, we're going to the uh, shopkeep, see if he's... Has anything <clears throat> about... Good turn. Nope, you guys go ahead. I'll stay back here. You guys come get me when you guys are done. All right, Derek, wherever you are, would you like to come? Why do I, I roll... Silly, okay. Oh yeah, I'll wait for him to come. Uh, Why do I roll so low at perception but so high at religion? Well, you are a freak. Makes sense. I don't persuade you a, either. You, you are a cleric, so why not? Yeah. You need the eye in religion. Okay. So David and Xenophia are leaving? 
Well, soon, well, soon as you know, she gets back to character. Okay, I would like to ask Kiki a question. No. <laughs> when she's gone. Uh, wait. Are you? Well, I, I think you should go to the shop and help because you are a man of the cloth. You can help with the persuasion. Okay. Okay. I would just agree with that in a way. Nope. Nope. <laughs> man of the cloth. Won't be doing the talking. Come on. Yep. Man of the cloth. He can help you. Okay. Kiki, I need you to roll me a d20. Six. Something happens. <laughs> I will DM you this. There we go. Mr. Claire, get down here. <laughs> One moment, something is happening in the background. <laughs> Come on, Neil. Get down yep, here. Follow them. Ah. <coughs> I thought I maybe I hear something it. breaking out of the basement or not. No, you don't. Okay. Don't worry, so, I'll kill it if it's anything. Okay. There you uh, go, what, what do I do? Do I just stay outside? Yes. Okay. Excuse me, Mr. Shopkeep. Yeah, what do you want? I need to know if you know anything about Gertrude Belinsky or where she would be at, possibly. Or if you've ever seen her out and about. I'm not paid enough to keep track of everybody in this godforsaken town. Uh, you want to find someone, go fucking look. Hmm. Are your boy something or what? I figured that you'd be able to, but apparently... You're just a shrewd vapor. Good day. Say what you want, I'm richer than you. Perhaps... <laughs> perhaps you are. But guess what? Money no. can save you from those outside. They're dead, I ain't. Fair enough. Hmm. Let's see. Oh, Kiki, what was it you wanted to talk to me about? What was with the bells? Looks like he's not going to help. What I really don't want to do anything okay. bad. Uh, <laughs> what was your plan just now, Xanafia? I wouldn't worry about too much, little one. I would like to check for garlic. I'm not going to knock, I'm just going to enter. I learned. <laughs> Hi! What? Do you sell garlic? I sell lots of things. You got the money for it. Yes. Don't ask me how. <laughs> uh, do you have garlic? Let me see here. He's going to be going through the, his stuff here. Well, 
Yeah, I've got a single garlic here for about oh, a ten gold. One garlic only. One garlic, a ten gold. Okay, what can I do with one garlic, Parroquet? I don't know, what do you think you could do with it? I mean, can I eat a, a piece of garlic or do I consume the whole thing instantly? As an item. You'd consume it instant, the whole thing if you wanted to eat it. Ah. Uh, I thought about okay. sharing a piece with everyone in case of a vampire attack. Yeah, one, one so garlic, it's, garlic it's So you uh, consume oh. the whole garlic? Yes. yes. Okay. So I believe the one good, garlic is technically one gold load of garlic. garlic. <laughs> okay, ten gold. Ten gold per garlic. Oh, how many does he how many do you have? One. Enough. I but bitten yet. Why ten gold? Oh. Why not five? Because I can, and people want them. So they're gonna pay for them whether they like it or not. But Otherwise, they can take their luck with the vamps themselves. Where the fuck is this voice going? Do you have holy water? If I had holy water, you think I'd be stuck here, not in the fucking church? No, that doesn't sound like a bad job. I could be a churchman. <laughs> Make holy water and charge for that too. How much is holy water worth for you? I know it's the situation you are in and I know it's worth. If you want holy water from me, considering, uh, well, lack of water right near us, the fact that we've only got one priest that ain't always available, a single jar of uh, holy water will cost you about 500 gold. Okay, then how about I give you two holy water? Two, not just one, two. And I'll get just 10 garlic for it. He's going... Are you just going to hand him the holy water then? In exchange for ten garlics. You didn't answer my question. No. I mean, he seems to be slightly mischievous. Maybe he'll just take it and laugh. Ha ha ha. Pay you for it. So yeah, what do you say? I say... I'd have to check the quality of this holy water. You see some of those empty houses? Some people had some holy water too, and now they're gone. Okay, I'd Chris. probably have to get to you tomorrow after I have them checked by the priest. Because you realize how much of a luxury I have in holy water be now. Yes, I can also make holy water by the way, so um, my services could also be of advantage to you. But tell me this, how do you intend to exactly ch let it check? He's a holy man who works with holy spells and shit. How else am I going to have him check? Or check it against the stuff he makes. I finally found a working opportunity for his son. Zan's gonna look at you. Let's go. But. I would like to roll for insights. What? Is he telling the, tru the truth or is he trying to screw me off? No, scam me. He's scam. telling the truth and that he'd have to get them checked before he pays you for them. Okay, fair enough. Let's go. Let's hurry up. Also, wait a second. You. 
I was thinking okay. we won't be here tomorrow, will we? Maybe not. But we won't know. How much are healing poultices worth for you? 50 gold. Would you like 10 poultices for 10 garlic? You do realize there's going to be a difference in supply and demand, correct? I mean, making poultices with the current nature status is quite dangerous. Like gathering herbs and stuff. Yeah. Okay, take oh. the two holy water and I'll return for the garlic uh, another day. So Is that a deal? Alright. I'll make sure to get your payment after I'll get them checked. Okay. Let's shake hands. He's gonna shake hands with you. Shakey, shake, shake. Okay. It's a deal then. Uh, have a good day. And have my blessing. Yeah, yeah, whatever. So while that's going on, I believe Dare to ask me a question. So while they're in there doing a chatty, I'm gonna say, hey, Dare, you said uh, you're asking me what I wanted to ask earlier. Mm -hmm. There is a shopkeeper who is very greedy. Just saying, if, you know, with your skills, if he was a little lighter on coin to fund our cause, you know, might help out more if it's in our arms than his arms. Just saying, because I know we were going down that way to check on the Howling Lady. Are you asking Derek to break in and steal things? Yeah, I'm asking Derek to rob this <laughs> asshole. <laughs> yes, I am, because this guy is a douchebag. <laughs> Kiki's going to get back after all this talk. Thank God she's back after all that talk already. <laughs> yeah, Xana's like, I was this close to Derek. smashing someone's mm. face. As you get closer to the shop, you actually notice this. <laughs> and if it will bring this up. I'm not going to lie. That actually, that literally was what I was going to talk to you about because of my first encounter with them. I'm like, OK, this guy's an asshole. He deserves to be robbed. You are actually going to see the shopkeeper and one other person on horses leave the village. <laughs> Is the building locked up? Yep. Hmm. For all you anyway, can realize that means they just ran with your holy water, right? Exactly. You you don't you don't want to say it with that tone. You want to be more pissed off. I mean, I don't know. I'm just saying this out of character. No, <laughs> yeah, out of character. You should be pissed. <laughs> I don't know. He took off with your shit. <laughs> Derek, go ahead and give me your check for your tools if that's what you're going to do. Alright, let me... Where's this guy? Post this... Okay. <laughs> oh, you talked to the shopkeeper! Is that where you... Get? Yeah, I, I know, that's why uh, I was having a nice chat with Derek while you guys were out. <laughs> Apropos shopkeeper, I offered him two holy... holy... water. Uh, in exchange for yeah. 10 garlic next time we return. Did we get uh, draft horse going because... Not enough to hear the voices. Okay, so efficiency is double. I get an additional plus five. Nice. Uh, oh. Let's see, sixteen. So that'd be twenty-seven. Who was the other nice. person? The lock practically pops apart in your hands. Okay. Did they leave anything in the building? Oh yeah, they left plenty of stuff. After all, they essentially just got two tickets free out of all this bullshit and away from the castle. Hmm. 
Okay. Money's good. Living's better. When you're charging 10 gold a car, like, hell yeah. <laughs> God damn. All right, give me an investigation check if you're going to be looking around here. Let's see. Oh, that, I'm pretty sure someone just gave some, some holy water. I'll just probably use my passive investigation. That's a 19. Oh, it's for garlic. Holy shit, I forgot about that. God damn. <laughs> you mentioned that he you yep. gave him holy water. <laughs> Are you worried it's about something, Sanafia? <laughs> no, I am not worried. But She's not the one that just got swindled. <laughs> You're the one that got swindled. If. Okay. You find essentially an assortment of goods, sundry, both food, items, usual gear and equipment you see at most shops. All right. You know what? We're going to take everything. We may as well just get the cart down here. The carriage. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> buddy. <laughs> I mean, Kiki's going to go along with whatever you say because you're on board with her. You are her tag team partner right now. Did you just acquire real estate? Technically, you could. We have liberated a lot of assets. Wow, it's just for two holy water, what a scam! <laughs> You're lucky I was pissed off at this guy two sessions ago. I mean, technically, <laughs> you own multiple places because the death house that you went to before had the deeds to the death house itself, as well as a mill and some other plots. You are telling yeah. us that mm -hmm. now? I mean, no, that was four. two sessions ago. That was like a session ago. <laughs> Never mind, I yeah. forgot. Probably. We liberated quite a few documents from that house. And ah. since there's no living... Since uh, the children that wow. we're going to go to are no longer. There's your new base. <laughs> <laughs> what is tea? <laughs> Literally. Yes! And the funny thing is, I know where they are. So, that did that. Are you sure? Sharp click you yes. Okay. Only if it Tell doesn't include you... lead. Tell me why you know where they are now. Uh, there's a spell that I have to find items I know and must have seen and know how they look like. We now have a building with all the stuff inside. One moment, where was wait, it wait, again? Wait, 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 wait. Without question, just follows. I, I was in the character. context of this. <laughs> I uh, go ahead. Uh, but then it, but is it... like, what the heck is going on? Uh, She's going to go in, like, wait, where's the shot keep? <laughs> they ran away. They what? That little stinky little Where is it? One moment, I'm looking. Yes? <laughs> yes, Parokit? What's your spell that can uh, show you? Boy, those crickets are really convincing. <laughs> what a spell. <laughs> Wait, I'm looking. I have a long list. Locate Three objects. Now. If you if you can, man, if you can twist Found this it. somehow. Locate objects. You. There's your crickets. Describe or name an object that is, <laughs> hey, that is familiar to you. You send the direction to the object's location as long as that object is within 1,000 feet of you. 1,000 feet. Yes. I think they're a long gone by a thousand feet. <laughs> but there are quite a few places where they most likely can be. What you're gonna do once you find them, though? And how do you know they left? <laughs> you just told us. If the object is in motion, you <laughs> know the direction of right. its movement. How do you know? You told me. Exactly. So. Uh, 
Well, what do I do? Did I follow them? You're, you're right here at the church. You can tell that they left the building and have headed out west. Derek, with your investigation check, give me one more. Hey. Oh, those sleety, little sneaky bastards. Yeah, Tony. Nice. Does it pass? Uh, that's a nat 20. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I'm going to say this once. I'm real glad we're coming to the close of this session because I have to make up a list. But Jesus fuck. <laughs> God damn it. All right. So you managed to find the paperwork for this building. So by owning the paperwork, you technically own the building. What's the job, off? Derek? <laughs> but again, I'll have to make up the full list of everything you found with a... Fucking Nat one. You know, I'm really glad you vanished on me earlier because this was way better than what I had in mind. I was gonna say, go for the cash register. <laughs> can I roll a sight of hand? You can if you try, if you want to. Go oh, ahead, roll a sight of hand. Does he want to get into a sight of hand competition with me? You know that uh, feeling. You know that feeling you get whenever you bang your knee against a table, and your pinky is what hits it first. That's what just happened with your pinky finger. How my pinky finger? Roll a d4 and take that damage. How? Ha ha! You just slightly smushed your pinky finger, but you still got yourself. Ow. But congratulations, you managed to successfully take over two buildings of the entire town. One of wow. which wants you dead. Yeah, that's good. That's just resale anyway. We're so good. next building's a mansion? But as of right now, I will ask. So I'll assume that you're going to be going by carriage, but this will definitely be a safe place for you since you own it. And it's heavily however, barricaded. Yep. However, I will ask Wow. one last time, yeah? Where exactly do you want to head next? Have you said to the Abbey, uh, yeah. yes? I think we are agreed to the Abbey. Yeah. All right. I mean, we can so make I... it, uh, the trip through the town. To the Abbey. Who is the one that will be driving? Me. After I, I took mean, a break. I, wait, if we're doing a long rest. No, I want to rebuild. We're not going to be doing a long rest yet. So now it'll uh, be Eel. Eel will be driving? Okay. Yes, please, I need a break. Let me rest. <laughs> Alright. So. I will ask Rivale where he will want to, like which roads he'll want to take on this, but that will be for your personal DM as well as next session. Hmm. I'm thinking, well, first of all, about taking the road safe, and I see there is uh, a little side road uh, along yeah, the river. That's what I'm going to ask if you want to take side roads or main roads. I mean, the main route is slightly longer, going through a forest, potentially more dangerous, but the side route is maybe in worse shape and maybe overrun by monsters at this little village thingy. And that is why I will ask you personally. So I'll be sending you some DMs tomorrow. Oh, uh, okay. Since it has gotten fairly late. And like I said, I got to make up the list because somebody rolled a fucking nat 20 on investigation. Now oh, who stole who? <laughs> <laughs> not mad about it. I rolled the slate of hands. I, I know rolled... you're not mad about it. <laughs> you're welcome. I rolled the slate of hands Why? to roll afterwards if welcome? I switched the water beforehand or not. <laughs> All right. not but I can make it. Man. It's not a problem. Are we going through downtime now? Yes. I would I like to set. take a look at One my sec. woodworking. 
One Tools. moment here. Let me bring up my notepad. Okay, okay. And I will have Shadow go first. With my perception check. Yep. You have five successes, I believe. That's an eight. That's a fail. Okay. Okay, you have five successes. And I will put those spaces there. And you are going for, what was it again? Me? Your, your feet, or... What, for me, or... Uh, for you, on. yes. Uh, alert. All right. I'm making a note here. And Ravale. Yes. Well, you're going to be practicing your woodworking? I would like to finally do it, now that we can do it more or less safely. Alright, give me your downtime check. Okay, what do I do again? This would be nature. Nature, okay. Hey, I have proficiency in nature. Let's go. Considering your background and the fact that you would actually know a bit about wood due to your god and your training and upbringing. Uh, do I have to hold mm. again? Because of proficiency? Yeah. Uh, just give me your roll for nature, just a roll with that, and let me know what you get. I just got a six. That is going to be a fail. Yeah, I, yeah. All but right. it was a one. Zeeth? Damn mm. it. Yeah, we're only going to be doing the one roll. I'm too tired. Zeeth, anything you wanted to roll for? Uh... Hmm. Let's see. Cat, that is my foot. Stop it. We'll do our downtime stuff here. And yeah. I have forgotten my tunes. Uh, let's see. I'm just kind of looking through some things because I know there's No. Some things that'd be useful for me. Nothing as of the moment. Ah. Uh... Say, so if you want are some we more time the... to... Oh, hmm? go ahead. I was going to say, are we going to use the legacy rules for feats or the new one? I will be adaptable to this and say however you want to use them. Because I know, like we had with uh, Shadow Kitty, there are two types of the alert feat now. Whichever one you want to use, that is the one you may use. I am not going to be picky about that until you use modern rules when not everything is completely fleshed out yet from what I've seen. So if you want to use the old version or the new version, it is up to you. Okay. I'm just taking a look here at... And go back to reading her book. <laughs> You'll get a full eight hours on that. And then uh, I'll let you know the time span that you'll have for travel since you guys are going to be heading for the Abbey. So uh, I'll get a full eight hours now on that book or all together? I will let you know here in a bit once I do all the calculations of distance and time. Okay. About wow. the traveling. I would like to uh, talk about it with the group, like what road we take. Because I'm a little bit curious about that little village at the river there. Say, out of character, you wouldn't know that exists unless you take that road. Oh. And if I ask about the road? 
let's say you're traveling the road, you see the road, you may ask the group in a private chat whether or not you want to take the side road or the main road. I mean, what do the well natives know about it? Uh, Peter and uh, Kolyaka, or what her name was. They've lived in Barovia, the little town that you're all in. Only? For as long as I can remember. Yep. Oh. Remember, Irina doesn't have most of her memories, and her brother has had no reason to leave since he's the Burgermeister's son, so he kind of has to stay. Okay. Any information right. about the land and the mansion, maybe? One second. Okay. Go ahead again, Zeeth. I was just looking at uh, Dual Wielder. Right. Uh, the new one. Just the only good thing about the new Dual Wielder is that you get a plus one to strength or dex. Yep, that's why I said you can use the older new one as you wish. Like I said, it's not the best. They they took they they gimped feats in the new one. Yep. Yeah, a lot of them. Martial classes got a lot more to them, but in exchange, a lot of things got really nerfed. Y yep, mm. they took power from one spot and put it somewhere else. Yeah, that's why I'm saying you can pick as you like. I'm not going to force you to pick something that I know probably isn't going to work for you. By the way, I upgraded my spells. Just uh, say. All right. Oh, hi, Tiger. What? Ow, oh, thank you. <laughs> Would you like yes, to... I'm to you. DM me what your choice would be and your role later once you've done some more research on it. Yeah. All I'll right. That. that way we can speed things up. Fair enough. Anything that you want to roll for then, Saren? Yep, I DM'd you that. That's the feat I'm probably going to go with. Oh, yeah. Got it. So should All I throw right. a strength that be based off of? or That would be going by base... Of that, what it usually is, it'd be athletics. Okay. Can I point out something funny? Mm, not one, so I hurt myself on that. Yep. <laughs> My brain hurts. Would you like a good berry? Not really, no. Would you like a poultice? No. <laughs> I want to sit in the corner and cry. <laughs> No one wants my help. <laughs> so, we take in Can note, I mention uh, something funny? One second. What's that, Shadow? Take in note that I had about, what, four, not four, four, five and a half hours already on my book. Yep. So, okay. There, setting up your spaces for your checks. So it'll be saved in my notepad. Is there anything else anyone else wants to run through before I shut down the session for the night and wish you all to get some sleep since it is running about four hours now? I just want to mention something silly. Yes? Uh, it took you multiple hours to acquire, basically, the rights to a building. And it took me only a few minutes. <laughs> With two holy water. Yeah. I mean, no, I, I would say he. <laughs> no, that's not how that worked. It was thanks to Garrett because he found the deeds to an abandoned building. Yes, you got swindled, actually, very much. I mean, you... for the price of two holy waters that he can easily make, he made the building abandoned. I will give him that. And I can find them now if we are in range. Yep. Maybe there's a new side quest. Who knows? Maybe. You know, a funny thing I would like to say, this is off of topic of the current group, yeah. is the interesting one connection quest between both Domino and Mina. <laughs> right. The <name> of Ace. <laughs> <laughs> that's, the only, that's the only quest that both of them technically share. Although they're doing it in different ways. She's looking in libraries, looking up information. He's just going out there. <laughs> yep. I w I, that would be funny. Well, anyways, yeah. Thank Where you for it? the session. Yeah, not a Where problem. Where is the located? 
the mill. You yes. would have to find it because the deed itself doesn't describe where it is. That just that the ownership of the deed essentially grants you ownership of said mill. Wow. Okay. Essentially, put the people that were supposed to know where it is are no longer around. Let's ask them. They're dead. Let's ask them. <laughs> the but dead. <laughs> your necromancer's coming a little strong there. For the team. <laughs> For the team, I'll do some necromancy. Xana's uh, going to look at him like, what <laughs> are you doing? I'm not forcing them to answer. If they don't want to, they don't have to play along with the spell. Where? She's just going to give him a look. <laughs> Mina, All is right. it you uh, in different well, form? Why, while her hand <laughs> is on her sword. I will send you all off here. All right. Make sure you guys get some rest, because I know you got stuff to do. Yeah. My low charisma is I... causing so many problems for me. <laughs> <laughs> you're you're not right. just your charisma, your freaking obsession with the dead. I'm neutral. <laughs> May I point right, out? Right. I will wish you all a very good night. Thank yes, you thank for you. dropping by, and I hope you enjoyed the session and the fact that you managed yes. to uh, essentially kick somebody out of their home and take it. Mm -hmm. Without them knowing. <laughs> <laughs> I don't yes. think he cares now. I mean, His you just problem. essentially gave him a free ride to get to an actual protected village that isn't dying. But I will send that list of stuff that you found to you later, Derek. Mm -hmm. And, and uh, the uh, amount of time that we're spending on the road. Yep. Okay, right. so we so move everybody... everyone into the new base? Essentially. But okay, I will good. send you all off now. Make sure you all get some rest again. And I will see you all next week or whenever. And we'll go from there. Okay, I would like to bye leave bye. a letter Thank to Donovich. Bye bye, bye everyone. Bye. Have a nice week. Hmm? Okay, ladies and gentlemen, that was today's session. Oops, a little, a little bit different today. Uh, less action, but more, I guess, story-related stuff and obligatory preparations. I would say. Hey, we got the base now. I can finally take a break. Ah. And now I would like to check uh, my role or aka nicknames. Uh, what? Strat kill counter. Eel. Light. Bright. What? Light? Wait, let me Google. Uh, what? English? Light? Bright? Google doesn't know either. Wait, uh, bright? What the hell is bright? Hello? Light bright. Ha! <laughs> ah, anyway, yeah, this was today's session. Um, until next week, with maybe more action, we will be on the road. And, uh, yeah, we will see what will happen I yeah anyway uh, I'm gonna go take a break and uh, ask around uh, in discord about um, 
the next steps because I would like to maybe check the mansion to see if there is any information or maybe map of the country, you know? I mean, that would make sense. Or maybe there's a library in town or something. I don't know. Anyway, uh, goodbye and um, have a nice weekend. Ciao! -y.